Hello everyone, welcome on back to the dojo. Happy Wednesday, revered. Glad to see you. Seems like you're gonna be out for a little bit. Happy half birthday to your sister. Hopefully we'll see you when you get back from dinner, but enjoy, enjoy. We are back today with Paper Mario, The Thousand Year Door. And last time we started chapter four, I say started, because uh, although we did collect the crystal star, uh, we actually didn't. We got tricked, we got duped, we were even, I'd say, bamboozled by the villain of this town. Um, we got turned into this, like, ghost-like figure. He stole our, our name and our, uh, I don't think he stole our body, but he stole, like, our look. I don't quite know how to say it. But, the big cliffhanger we left on last time is now we have Vivian on our team. One of these, uh, the evil three, I don't know, people working for the, the x knots So, I have no idea what's gonna happen now that she's on our team, but I'm very excited. And... Uh, some new ability she gave us is that we can talk to crows, and we can hide. I forgot we can do that, so we can uh, kind of escape battles sometimes. But now we can listen in on the crows since we can hide, so let's gather some information, shall we? How do I listen to the crows? Uh, let's stand right there, right there. Ah, there we go. Aha, so the crows do say more than just ca ca ca. So I was chatting with Rotbeak in Mushroom Town on Instant Messenger yesterday. Instant Messenger? I gotta send emails and you guys got Instant Messengers? What is this? Mario stuck with that old Game Boy Advance SP email system. And he said he'd just gone fi uh, fiber optic on his home network. You believe that? Rad. I bet he's downloading 100 meg apps with no problems on those fat pipes. <laughs> he's probably surfing that feather club for Crow's site at the speed of light now. Yeah, it just blows me away all this information age hype you hear about. And yet, it's all games and feather loss sites that are driving the technology. Yeah, but I think tech bus survivors can thrive if they get viable business models. I don't even know what the heck these guys are talking about, but alrighty then. Mr. Krabs, welcome on in! Happy Wednesday! Welcome back to the dojo. My friend almost owed me a lot of money. Why did your friend almost owe you money? Tell us as we listen to these crows. I've been really depressed lately thinking about the depletion of fossil fuels. Oh my god, why does this game get so dark and real? Yeah, tell me about it. We've got to come up with an, a renewable energy source before that happens. Like wind or hydroelectric. I think solar energy probably has the greatest potential. Well, good thing this, like, uh, what, 2004, 2006 game is commenting on our, uh, our actual life now. Alright, what does this lone crow have to say? Alas, this twilight world is... Twilight? I think he meant twilight. Is too full of pain and contradiction, too full of broken dreams. Perhaps I was only given wings so that I could flee the terror of uh, mundane... Mundan... Mundane-y? I don't know how to say that. Oh, God. His mundane life. That's what he wants to escape. Uh, as we were walking home from school, he decided it was a good idea to push me over while I was holding my clarinet. Oh, my God. Okay, the fact that your friend pushed you over at all just wasn't... That, that's rude. I, mean, I would assume your clarinet's not damaged, though, since they don't owe you money. That's good. If I didn't hold on to it for my life, it would have broken. Well, good for you for protecting the instrument. That's a true band kid right there. <laughs> hey, Mod, listen to this. Ronnie, my oldest, is taking his SATs this year. Ew. Ugh, SATs, gross. Oh, is little Ronnie that age already? Well, bless my feathers, Flo. Okay, none of these crows have given me any useful information. Oh, oh, what is that? Oh, no, 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 that's just the... She messed up in the shop. She thought the pig was her husband. It was not her husband. That was... We dealt with that last stream. So that Mario guy meeting with the mayor, he's actually the bad guy, right? That is a lie. Wait. Actually, that's not... No, that's not a lie. The bad guy is masquerading as Mario right now. That is the truth. I take it back. <laughs> and nobody even knows. Humans are so dumb. It makes me want to peck their noses. Do it. Go peck the mayor's nose. Or the fake Mario's nose. That works, too. Next time, I might just have to let go. No, don't do it. Don't ever drop that clarinet. No damaging it. You take the damage to yourself first. You can heal. The clarinet needs fixing. <laughs> the only soul that knows the bad guy's name is locked under Creepy Steeple, I hear. Locked under it? Oh, okay. We gotta go back to Creepy Steeple. Because, you know, if no one knows your name, then you can use unstoppable magic. But if someone says your real name to you, then your magic will stop working. Okay, so that's how, uh, that's how the logic works in this universe. I think I might get my smash earnings tomorrow. Hey, nice! Congrats! 
But you got uh, you got third on Sunday's tournament. Nice. I would definitely... I know I missed it because I was busy, but I, I want to see your Amiibo fight. Because you said that tournament wasn't you guys fighting. It was the Amiibos you trained, which is really, really cool. I wonder how all this is going to end up then. We're going to find out. Did you hear that? If we search under Creepy Steeple, maybe we can find out that guy's real name. Let's do it. Back to Creepy Steeple we go. Post a clip? Yeah, yeah, definitely. Throw a clip in chat. I'll definitely check it out. Hey, what's up, Slick? Been waiting for you. I would have done this back in town, but that wouldn't have looked very good, would it? Is fake Mario back? Oh, he is. He just jumps right out of the sky. What? He ripped a hole in the sky. So this is the one who stole your name and body. Yes, it is. If you see those dark, soulless, like, black hole looking eyes, that's fake Mario. He looks sort of familiar to me. All right, can the chatter. Here's the deal. You get the ch you get your chance, then I stop you. If you guess my real name, then you get your body and your name back. Fire away, no name. Uh, I don't yet know your name. Oh, there's a missing letter too, so I literally can't spell his name. There's uh, the lowercase p is missing, so I can't spell his name. We'll call him Star. That's that's gonna be his name is Star. Space Star, apparently. <laughs> There you go, that's what I think your name is. Rongamundo, little nobody. Who'd name their kid that? Prepare for doom, slick. And don't even think about running away from battle here. No running. Okay, well, last time we ran, so I'm gonna run again, because we have no way of fighting him, because we don't know his name. Uh, run away. No, I didn't mean to defend. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, run away. There we go. I love how Mario's running, but Vivian just kind of floats backwards there. <laughs> that was cute. We escaped him! Aw, that's no fun. Ooh, let me check out the clip. Alright, let's see. Let's see what you got here. He must have been hiding there in ambush, waiting for you to show up. Well, forget him. Let's get your name back. Cool. Alright, let's see this clip right here. So this is uh Mr. Krabs clutch win. Let's uh, switch over to that. There we go. So King K. Rule is uh your amiibo that you trained. And you're versing, what is that, a peach? Or, no, that's Daisy. Okay, nice it, nice it. You're, uh, oh, you spiked her! Oh my god, dude, that was nuts! What a win, what a comeback. Nice spike. Dude, that was, that was nutty. That was nutty. You love to see it. My friends have definitely done that to me before. I've definitely gotten spiked. Leave me alone. Yeah, you don't know where I am, huh, Goomba? Get the hell out of here. Don't touch me, don't touch me, don't touch me, don't touch me. Can be a flying one, yep. Leave me alone. Lots of solid 10k CPS from that. Oh god. Oh, and Daisy won the set. Oh, how do I do this? Uh like this? Yes! Aha. Okay. Back to creepy steeple we go. I know what you meant. Yeah, that that was incorrect grammar, but I knew what you meant there. There was only one other uh one other use for the word one. And if it wasn't the number, I figured it meant that you had uh, actually won the tournament. Or that uh, uh, Daisy had won the set, you meant. It's a shame that I can't move in the shadows like this. I can only pop up. Walk past me. No, I need you to walk past me. Okay, hang on. Well, that's good. At least, as long as I hit the hide button before the flower thing touches me, or before the enemy touches me, and I'll be able to hide then. I just wanted to walk to the right. Go to the right! Dang it. Okay, well, I can't unhide if she's right over me. There you go. Keep walking that way. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Yes! Go, 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 go! Go! Yes! I made it. Let's go. Avoided the fight. They don't even know where I am. Okay, come towards me. Thank you. It doesn't help with the tree in the way. This is a really bad spot to do this. Uh, maybe I can pull her a little further over. There you go. No, come this way. Ah, oh, you suck. All right, I'll get as close to her as I can. Good. Okay, just gotta wait for her to walk to the right. Maybe. No, I can get closer. Oh! Ooh. So close! I do not want to do this battle. Okay, we're good. Go, 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 go! Yes! We avoided the battle! Let's go! I hate these little flowery things. Go to the right. Come on, move to the right, move to the right. Okay, that's fine. This is fine, this is fine. Super stealth mode. Here we go. Second one? No second one. Yes. Let's go. 
We lost Vivian! Oh no! Mario's by himself! Oh, there she is. <laughs> Just messing with y'all. Uh, this was to get past the rock. Yeah, we gotta go in here. Come up over here. And no, you do not. Hydrate or dihydrate will do, Mr. Krabs. Mr. Krabs, did you actually, did you uh, hit affiliate status yet? I know you hit three, uh, 30, no, three average followers, but you have to uh, still apply for it technically. So did you get it? I just heard some guy screaming at the top of his lungs. Oh my god, that's not terrifying. Is he asleep? Oh, he's not asleep. He was asleep. <laughs> what? Dude, you can't hide right on top of me? What is this? Okay, that, I literally, I couldn't avoid him. And Mario's gonna get hurt too because he jumped on a spike, you dummy. Yeah, dummy. Let's, uh... Shoot, I don't remember the tactics. You know what? Let's see how Vivian fights. What she got? Shade Fist. Attack with a burning punch. That sets enemies on fire. Nice. Okay, we like that. Not for a bit for affiliate. Oh, how come? What happened? Or well, we can do Veil, hide in the shadows with Mario to avoid attacks. Okay, so that's a defensive move. Let's do this one. And I said I don't think I can set these guys on fire. Let's set the, the flower on fire. I don't know which one's X. Oh god. Okay. I gotta remember the buttons, because I'm on PlayStation and Vivian's using different buttons! Um, can I jump on someone else? I can. Okay. Uh, do -do -do. attack by first stomping and spin jumping on enemies. Let's do that to this one. Pretty good, pretty good. We got three damage, or five damage there. Dang, he just charges attack. No, do not put me to sleep. Crap. And I'm asleep. And that flower's gone. Alright, whatever. <laughs> Hey, Ali Kane! Welcome on in! Welcome, welcome! Ooh, did we kill him? No! Dang it! Still need one more attack on this one. Um... Mario can kill the flower. Let's try using this. I don't think I can burn this, though. Why? Oh my god. I didn't know which one was why! My buttons are a PlayStation controller! This is not fair! Don't fall asleep. Please don't fall asleep. Okay, alright. But she didn't fall asleep. Oh, I forgot Mario. Oh, and she's dead. Alright, and Mario can't do an attack! Shit! And just powered her up again. Ah, oh, crap. Well, this isn't good. I think it's time we run. Hey, we got lucky. Let's go. Oh, you have to you have to put in your address to get a uh, to get affiliate status, and that's the reason you don't want to do it. <laughs> think of it as a Nintendo controller. I've never owned a GameCube controller, so I don't know the mappings. Oh my God, I'm gonna freaking die! Mario won't wake up. What is this? Oh, thank God. Okay, run away. Get me the hell out of here. Jesus. Are you having a better day today? I'm glad, Allie. I'm glad you're doing better. Okay, let's get the hell out of Dodge. Do not want to do that fight again. Yes, and we can heal. And we can save. Thank God. Okay, we're good. I hope you have a safe flight home tomorrow, Allie. Now you're coming home to see some family. Y is square, X is triangle. Oh, X is triangle. Okay. I didn't realize Y was square. So this is Y? This is the Y button? I thought this is the... I thought that was the X button. Nope, that's the cancel button. Shadows Owl! Thank you so much for the Prime Gaming sub! Oh my god, it's been so long! Shad, how are you doing? Welcome on back to the dojo! How are you? We're playing some Paper Mario today. I'm trying to remember the different controls because I am not playing on a GameCube controller. I'm playing on a PlayStation controller. So uh, when it says X and Y, it corresponds to like square and triangle. So it's a little hard to remember. <laughs> but how you doing, Chad? How have you been? Yeah, it's all right. I'll figure it out, Mr. Krabs. It's all good. Very excited to see everyone. Definitely. Oh, let me hide. Definitely need it right now. Uh, I'm gonna hop in the shower here soon, but I'll keep it on in the background. Well, thank you for lurking, Allie. I appreciate the support. Don't touch me. Okay, uh, we need to figure out how to get underneath this place. And I'm not sure where to go for that. So... Ooh, oh, wait, 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 there's this. What was down here? Did we finish whatever was down here? Because I remember there was a path. This was just to a chest. Okay, that was nothing. 
What in the world did you just put in chat? <laughs> Those are some random shapes, dude. Doing a little bit better, been through a lot as of late, which is why I've been gone for a while. I hope you're doing okay. Hope you're doing okay, Chad. Glad to see you're back, though. What do we got? I opened the chest in here. Is there another- Oh, there is another door. Lock from the inside. What? How am I supposed to get past this, then? Okay, we need to find a way inside this locked door, of which I have no idea how to get through. Um, that's not gonna get us anything. Can I bust down the door? Nope, that's a no-go. Alright, you just keep on spamming those those weird symbols, Mr. Krabs. What do you got? You got all the uh, the card suits in there. I see a star, an X, a circle with a dot in the middle. I don't know what that one's for. Uh, where can we find a key here? Let, maybe, you know what, let's go back all the way up to his, uh, his top room and see if there's a key in there or maybe some trap door or something. Oh, we got the swoopers here, right? Yeah, we got swoopers. The other one. There he is. Let me pass, let me pass. Okay, hopefully the stairs are in the right spot. I'm on the way to being better. When I feel more up to it, I'll return to streaming and stuff. I'm glad to hear that. I'm really glad to hear that you will get back into streaming. Because I know if I had to take a break, even if it were necessary, I would still want to get back into it. So I'm glad to know that it's... Uh, I can't speak. I'm glad to know that you are looking at getting back into streaming, Chad. Uh, no, I am not doing your math or history homework, Mr. Krabs. That is on you. I did my years of school and college. I am done. I get that. Thank you. We got a golden leaf. That spawns there every single time you go. Okay, I'm pretty sure we already hit the button, right? Doesn't hurt to hit it again. Okay, yeah, we already hit it. Science, maybe? Uh, maybe we can help you with it if you have a question, but I'm definitely not doing your homework, Mr. Krabs. Okay. Oh, we do have a ghost up here. That's okay. We can get past him. We don't need him. Uh, I need... Oh, no! I don't have revered. Um... How do I make it past... I can't make it past this gap, then. I forgot I don't have my party. Oh, oh! I can! Ha ha ha! Let's go, dude! Let's go! I can just barely squeeze past. I don't know if that was intentional or not, but I'll take it. Hey, FG Gamer! Welcome on in! Welcome, welcome, welcome back to the dojo. Did Vivian get glitched there for a second? It looked like her uh, her tail was a lot longer. Oh, I'm dumb. I could have just probably jumped that gap. Whatever. Uh, can't open the fridge. Can't interact with the. Actually, can I interact with TV? Can I destroy it? No. Okay. Um. I really expected there to be, like, something hidden up here. I mean, there's got to be a key somewhere, right? That just makes us hide, so that doesn't do us any good. Dang, I really thought there'd be something up here. Okay, so where else can we go? There's that one secret room that we've already been in, but that didn't get us anything. Huh. Huh. Oh. I see why Fall Guys Gamer said three now. I missed the, uh, what's one plus one message. <laughs> if you don't know what one plus one is, Mr. Krabs, I think you should spend a little more time studying and a little less time speedrunning Super Mario Odyssey. Okay, nothing in there. Uh, let's drop down and go under here. See if there's anything else we missed in this room. Doesn't look like it. Can I get onto the cobweb? I can stand within the cobweb. Can I hide on the couch? That's cool. You can like use that shadow hide ability literally whatever on whatever you're standing on. Where is the key for this place? Do you guys have any idea where the key would be in here? I'm assuming it's somewhere within the castle. I just don't know where. And I shouldn't have to fight all these ghosts. Like I, I don't think that's the answer. I also don't remember what the most effective thing to do for these ghosts are, so we're just gonna try this. Oh, I never tattled these ghosts. I don't know how much, uh... I don't know how much health they have. The, is that one? Oh, I pressed X. Okay, so X is the right... X is circle. X is circle, I think. <laughs> Future elementary school teacher here. One plus one is definitely two, my friend. Thank you for stepping in and clarifying that, Allie. <laughs> 
uh, is there something outside? I don't think there's anything else out here. We can't get on the left side here. Like, I can bust out of here, but then I can't go to the left because of this boulder. Yeah, I can't go left. Uh, I mean, we can pick up another golden leaf while we're here. Might as well. There's nothing else to do over here. Maybe there's, like, something out front that I'm missing some way to get under, or some, uh, some key to find. Shad, thank you so much for the hundred biddies! Hey guys, if you have not heard yet, I'm going into a battle. If you haven't heard, I am currently fundraising for the Rescue Royale fun, uh, Rescue Royale Fall Guys tournament. You can see the uh, tracker right over there. We've so far raised 140 out of 500. We need 350 by this Sunday, 500 by next Saturday, October 2nd. If you guys want to help support me and make it out to Vegas to compete in a Fall Guys tournament in an esports arena, you can use the uh, command exclamation point donate for a link and do donate however much you feel comfortable with keep it in mind that all of that money goes directly to the Red Cross and helping families in need. Alright, let's do another jump on this dude. Oh, we got the swooper up top. I forgot about him. Okay, let's try her attack again. Oh, I got a slow shroom. Cool. Thank you, audience. Uh, let's do it... Let's do it on the swooper. Okay, what you gonna give me? X! I think that was good? Yeah, I hit the right button there. Okay, okay, good. I bought some bits just for you. I haven't bought them in so long. Aw, Shad, you didn't have to do that. I appreciate it, but bits are never necessary, guys. Just just being here, enjoying the stream with me, and hanging out, that is more than enough. Okay, Boo is dead. Oh, we got a slot machine. Let's go. Give me a bingo. Give me a bingo. Dang it. We tried, we tried. Alright, let's just uh, burn this fool. What do we got? What button? Y. Alright, so Y is the top button. Got it. Y and X are triangle and circle. The <laughs> cheap Mr. Krabs as usual. Actually, that's so on point though. <laughs> it makes sense that Mr. Krabs wouldn't donate. He would hoard all his money for himself. No, he was calling you the actual Mr. Krabs from Spongebob. Not just your username. <laughs> Okay, I still don't think there's anything here. Um, we got the key that was on the other side. That was just to unlock uh, the door at the end of this hallway. So let's head out front and see if there's anything. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. <laughs> I don't really want to get up and shower, but I need to. Take your time, Allie. Don't rush it. Don't rush it. You do you. Okay, we're gonna burn you gonna be? What's it gonna be? Why? We got it now. We know our buttons. We're probably gonna forget it by next week, but then we'll relearn it, so it's fine. <laughs> Uh-oh. They're all coming at once. I don't like this. Yeah, let's go with the lucky. <laughs> the boo was so confused why his attack didn't work. I got four clips in my last stream. All of them were about my socks. What? Why were all the clips about your socks? Okay, you should be dead. Hopefully. Yeah, you're dead. You're gonna burn. X. Nice. They're both gonna get burn damage now. Nope. Ah, I tried dodging it. One more, one more. Okay, alright. Took one less hit of damage. One should be dead. Nope, one is just no longer burned. Okay. Now you're dead. Have they gone back to town? Um, not since I lost my identity, no. So, we ended last stream with the, like, I I guess the midway point of Chapter 4, where I beat the boss, kind of, and then I thought I got the Crystal Star, but in reality, he stole my name and body. Uh, and that's where we left off, right after we got Vivian on our team. So right now, we are uh, back at Creepy Steeple, trying to get the key to unlock the door down in the basement and find the one person who knows the boss's true name. Because then once I call him by his true name, he doesn't have his powers or something like that. I'm not quite sure how the logic works. Yes, yeah, so I do need to find his name. And in order to find his name, I need a key. So I'm going to go search out front right now. Yeah, so uh, no spoilers, guys, but I might ask for a hint if anyone knows. Oh, you accidentally showed your socks on stream once? Then your chat was only talking about socks. Oh my god. I think that actually might be my most successful stream ever. That's great. There'll be plenty of those to come. Don't you worry about it, Mr. Krabs. Oh, what about this well? Was there anything that we could do with the well? 
Was this our other way in? I remember this being like a crazy battle room. Yeah, okay, we're gonna have to do like a million battles right now. <laughs> God damn it. Actually, maybe I can hide as soon as I get out of the battle. We'll try that. You know where it is, but I gotta find it. Yes, thank you, Shad. And I like someone who does not spoil things. I appreciate it. <laughs> yeah, this is just gonna be battle after battle. We can't really do anything about that. Uh, let's do multi bounce. Whoa. Shad, thank you for another 100 bits! So generous, thank you, thank you! Yes, let's go! Getting all the right buttons. Uh, I don't think that burnt him. Okay, and the multi bounce was not worth it. Let's just kill this one. There we go. I don't even know if her veil effect will damage him. It might just flip him over. Hey, let's go! We got all our flower power back. I mean, so we're only getting two back, but hey, we got a bingo! <laughs> That's pretty cool. Oh, and our audience jumped up to 100. Holy crap. Okay, audience. I see you. I see you. You want a show? I'll give you a show. Almost pressed the wrong one. Oh, that didn't even flip him over. Alright, that was a waste. I mean, there's nothing I could have done. The only better move would have been to defend. Okay, let's get some damage on him. And then you should hopefully finish him off. Let's go. GG's, GG's. Uh, you can purchase Bean Makeover after Gamer, but it's not going to apply unless I'm doing a Fall Guys stream. So, uh, you do you. Still learning your kindergarten math there? Good luck with that, Mr. Krabs. We believe in you. You can name 27 digits of pi. How many digits can I name? Three point, uh, the point's not a digit. 3.14159265358979393. 16, I can do 16 digits of pi. Hope that's enough to impress you. And you're dead. Cool. All right, so three more turns and we'll have them. Okay, Mario's taking way too much damage. All right, maybe maybe a little more than three turns. I gotta heal. Um, you don't do as much damage. Actually, no. We'll stick with Mario. No, we won't. Um, items. Do I have anything that gives me F. HP besides the Ultra Shroom? I don't want to use the Ultra Shroom. Hmm. Okay, then you know what we'll do... Not that. Uh, oh, she can't do special, only Mario can. Crap. We gotta do Sweet Treat. Hydrate or Dihydrate, revered... Don't mind if I do. You messed up the digits? You were close, I guess. <laughs> oh, even uh, FG Gamer knew three more digits than I did. I memorized the amount... The, however many digits I knew, I memorized that back when I was in high school. I just got bored one day, turned my phone on its side, and hit pi, and memorized however many digits the built-in calculator would show me. Alright, let's do Sweet Treat and heal up. God dang it, just trying to avoid that one. Go, 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 come on. There's only one more bad mushroom, there it is. One more Mario? No? Alright. Six Mario health, that's not bad. I think that's 12. Yeah, cool. Alright. Gives us a little extra health. We'll take it. Um, do we have any items we can use on them? Makes you invisible so attacks miss you. Oh, you know what? Let's use that. Maybe they'll miss Mario a little more often now. Alright, I'm not gonna read all those digits of pi, but I'll trust that you guys have typed them correctly. <laughs> Yes! Every attack went for Mario and every attack missed! That was fantastic. Okay. Now, let's do... Oh my god, Chad! Another 300 biddies! You're so generous! Thank you for the luck, the Shamrock biddies! I appreciate it, Chad! You're the best! Can we get some Chad? Actually, I don't think Revered is here. So, you're gonna get a shout out from me yourself. There you go, Chad. Let's get you, get you some shout outs. Guys, if you are not currently following Chad, go give her a follow. She will be returning to streaming sometime in the future. And when she does, you guys are not going to want to miss the streams. What attack are we going with? Why? Alright. Takes me a second to remember which button's which. Miss. And another miss. Right? Yeah, let's go. Um... 
No, Revered was here, Mr. Krabs. Revered just, uh, he had to leave because he went to his, uh, out with his family to a restaurant for his half-sister's, not half-sister, his sister's half-birthday. There we go. It's his full sister, it's her half-birthday. That's, that, that makes sense, right? I can English. I mean, depending on what time he gets back from dinner, he might be back in time for some of the stream. Miss. Okay, it's fine. At least we dodged it. Final move. And we gotta do this, like, how many more battles? Oh god. We have to do so many more battles. E. Let's go. At least we're getting through this. I'm gonna try and hide in between this, this battle and the next one. Let's see if we can hide. Nope. No, there's literally not even an opportunity. <laughs> Just as soon as you spawn in. Oh no, I can't jump on these guys. Shit. <coughs> That's not good. Um... Can I flip them over with my hammer? I don't even know if I can flip them over with my hammer. Shit. Okay, that is not good. I have no way of damaging them. How do I flip these guys over? I forgot. I don't know if I can flip them over with Vivian. Yeah, this isn't gonna work. We're gonna have to run. Crap. What do I think of the Paper Mario series so far? I think it's fun. Okay, I lost a lot of things in there, but we we avoided it, I guess. Nope, 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 leave me alone. Yeah, we lost some items and coins, but that's fine. I think this is how we're supposed to get through here, and I believe there's a doorway over there, but I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to fight these two spiky ones. That sucks. You need to play Origami King? I'm considering if I want to stream Origami King. It's, uh, if we could do that one easier, we wouldn't need an emulator. We could just buy it for Switch. Uh, I don't think I would go back and play the, the original Paper Mario. I am enjoying this one, though, and I, the reason I started with this one is because I know it's, like, uh, the, the top favorite amongst all of the series, the Paper Mario series. Okay, these guys can walk a little further away so I can get closer. Okay, cool. Two of them are, like, within each other. There they go. <laughs> they finally split up. Time to get up. All right, Allie, you go enjoy your shower. We'll see you when you get back. Don't touch me, don't touch me, don't touch me. Okay, all right, this is fine. Walk a little further away. Just walk walk that way. Walk to that side of the room. No, not towards me, dude. What are you doing? Okay, that's good. Yes? Oh, oh, okay, okay. I remember why we couldn't do this section before, and it's because we needed Vivian's ability. Now I remember. Okay. I got it, I got it. Get in, get in, get in, get in, get in. So we gotta push this bad boy up. And then just hide underneath it and let it fall right down. There we go. I don't know how we're gonna get back. I guess through the opposite way, but there, we uh we we made it past that puzzle. If I were to post my splits in your Discord, where would I do it? Uh I'm not sure. I don't have a channel set up for specific speedrunning stuff. Why why do you want to post your splits? GG, thank you, Shad, thank you, thank you. Took a little bit to get through that room, but I, I figured once I uh Thought to look out front, and I remembered the well was there. I figured that was what we were supposed to do. Oh, that's cute. Little little staircase for us. Something tells me we're supposed to ground pound our butt on this. To be cool. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I don't have a section for that, Mr. Krabs, so just hold off on posting the splits, please. You gotta go. All right, have a great night, Mr. Krabs. We'll see you hopefully uh, Friday for Fall Guys. Let's get through. Down we go. Oh, oh, okay, okay, this is the room we were in before, so now, actually, we should probably check what's on the right side first, just to make sure we don't miss anything. Doesn't look like it. Nope, okay, cool. Let's roll. Here we go, through the little slit in the wall. What in the world? What is this? Oh, it's not a person, it's a parrot that knows his name? That's fantastic. All right, what do we got in the chests? We got a Power Plus badge, and a Mr. Softener. Oh, I guess it makes sense that I wouldn't need to find a key since it was locked from the inside. And here we got a key, we got a steeple key, and the letter P. Oh, the letter P! This is why we couldn't spell his name before, because we needed the lowercase P and it was stolen from our board. That's awesome. All right, Mr. Parrot. Good morning, good morning. Pretty bird, pretty bird. Shine get, <laughs> shine get. Wait, that's that's not from this. That's from uh, that's from sunshine. Well, I guess that's not true. There are those boxes we jump into 
into to get the shine. That's funny, though. He's just gonna say those things over and over again. All right, let's hide and see what he's got to say. Scrap, what happened to those weirdos who were just here? Ah, oh, whatever. It was almost nice to have some company. I mean, no matter how important it is that uh, no one know his real name, lock me up in here just because I know it, and making me guard the name's stupid missing letter, no way to treat a parrot. I really do want a cracker, Dupless. Dupless, that's his name. You're a big meanie. When's feeding time, huh? Scrap! Uh, pretty bird, pretty bird. <laughs> He's all, like, messed up because he just gave us the exact name we needed. Dupless. What a name. What a name. Hmm. We heard that. We heard you, little birdie. Dupless, that's his name. Now let's get back your name and body from that meanie. And we'll teach him a lesson or two while we're at it. Alright, time to go beat Dupless's ass. Let's do it. Kick his butt. Send him to the Shadow Realm like he sent Mario. Wow, wow. No ghosts. No ghosts. No ghosts. Just gotta bob and weave. Alright, there we go. Now we get to go back through the forest and dodge some more flower fights. Uh, we already saved. We don't need to save again. Where's our first flower yet? Oh no, it's this dude. Uh... Okay, just gonna hide. Don't hide on top of me, please. No. Oh, god damn it. Okay. Well, there was nothing I could do there, but we are going to run from this like we did before. Yeah, 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 Mario. Freaking poke your foot all you want. Run away! Run away! I wonder if after chapter four we'll finally get those coins back from the dude at the dock who stole them from us. Well, I didn't really steal them from us. We kind of lent them to him, but I would like to get my coins back. You need a badge to stomp on sharp spikes? I wonder- I haven't looked at my badges in a while. Do we have anything else we can put on? I have no extra badge power. We should, uh, probably upgrade our badge power next. Revered usually tells me what badges I should use, because he's, like, really good at this game, and, uh, RPGs I'm typically not the best at. Okay, the flower doesn't even know where I am. Sure, walk right on past me, why don't you? There you go. Goodbye, Flowey. Nope, 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 nope. You ain't gonna fight me today. That's... Yeah, now you are. God damn it. <laughs> soft stomp? Do I have soft stomp on? I don't know what that is. No, I have... I don't have soft stomp. Uh, I guess we can try fighting them. There goes one of them. What do we got? What do we got? It is... X! Not sure of the name, just know it helps. Okay, will do. I'll make note of that one. Don't fall asleep. Ah, Mario, come on. Alright, let's burn the third flower in, or second flower, technically. Cool. Yeah, you're right. Uh, whatever badge we're talking about is most likely not equipped. Oh, did you both fall asleep? Alright, one flower left. Two flowers left. Did Mario wake up and end this? Yes, let's go. Alright. You did. You did. Here we go. Actually, oh my god, Mario is very close to dying and also very close to leveling up. Jesus Christ. Okay, uh, I have nothing that can heal Mario, so we have to make sure we do not get into this next fight. No, don't see me. Come over here. I don't want you tracking me. Come this way. Ah, you dumb flower. Damn it, I was trying to avoid it. Alright, I think I can just run. Oh no, one of the gold ones appeared! Dang it! I can't even, uh, tattle because I don't have Goombella. That sucks, man. We're gonna have to eventually come back and purposely fight one of them to get the gold flower. Ah, oh, shit. Do I get a second chance? Okay, thank god. That's the first time that's ever happened. There. Alright. We're out. We're out. Forget the coins. We'll get more later. Is that the end of the forest? Yes, thank god. Okay. We're free from the flower menaces. But, uh, I think we're about to go into the fight, aren't we? Isn't that, like, the next thing over? Ah, oh, shit. 
There's nowhere to save. Oh no, I'm gonna die in this fight. Oh crap. Alright, we gotta do something then. How do I not have anything other than the Ultra Shroom? Damn it. I don't know what to do here. Because I'm gonna I'm gonna die. Maybe I can go back to the castle and get full health. I guess that's the best bet, because I'm definitely gonna die if I go straight into the battle, and then I'll game over. Back we go! Come here. Okay, you're not even gonna track me? That's fine. That, you know what? That works too. That was actually really helpful. Are you still dead? Good. Okay. Should be an alive flower here. Yes, there is. Walk to my right. Walk to my right. Come on. More than that. There you go. There you go. Perfect. Goodbye. Goodbye. Alright, I have a feeling by the time we get to the castle, all the flowers are going to respawn. Which sucks. Drop through here. Got that cleft thing. No, 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 no. Go, go, go. Okay, that actually worked out really well. Should be here. Perfect. Alright. Heal and save. Now we can absolutely not get into any battles. If we get into any, we just gotta run away from them. Okay, deal with this left dude again. Don't touch me. Thank you. Okay. Four flowers. Maybe three. Flowers here should be the same. There should only be one, but I think there's going to be two on the next screen again. He doesn't even know I'm behind him. Now he does. Oh god. Alright, walk to my left. All the way to the left. There you go. Keep going. I cannot see you behind the tree, sir. Okay, well, we're, uh, we're going to be trapped here. There we go. Now we're not. Alright. One more room, and we're home free. Do, 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 do. I'm gonna walk further? No? Okay, I kinda want you to walk further away so I can, like, make some moves here. Wow, this flower's really just camping me. There you go. No, don't touch me. That's right, get confused. Goodbye. Is there a second one? Yes, there is. Okay. I have no idea how I'm going to get past this one, but we're going to wait for him to just walk away from this slit in the wall so we can walk through and just avoid him completely. Okay, it doesn't help when you're just covering it. There you go. Keep walking that way. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. That's it. One more. Yes. Perfect. Go, 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 go. We did it. All right. We made it back. We healed. No game overs. No deaths. Let's get it. Now we can go into this final battle. Only had a slight detour. Okay, so you were saying, uh, which one of these badges was super helpful? Uh, not that. Badges. Something stomp. Um, soft stomp. Wear this to use soft stomp. 2 FP are required to use this attack, uh, which can make foes soft if executed superbly. What do you mean makes them soft? Interesting. Okay. Uh, well, do we have anything for one that we can take off? Multi-bounce? I feel like I don't often use multi-bounce. Oh my god, Shad, another 200 biddies! Thank you so much! Thank you, thank you! Shad, if you want to convert those biddies into donation dollars for the fundraiser, I would greatly appreciate that. I mean, if you're going to keep throwing them. <laughs> All right, let's put on Soft Stomp, and we'll see what we can do with that. Maybe we can, uh... Oh, I, I had the Soft Stomp badge. I was just thinking maybe we could use that on the boss to make him soft. I don't know what that would do, but we can try it. Okay, this should put us right into the boss battle. Right? Hey, what's up, Slick? Been waiting for you. Busts out of the sky again. Hey Slick, time to cancel your magazine subscription, cause you're getting erased! But first, please amuse me with one more guess. 
it really gives me joy to watch you squirm in futility as you try to guess my name. So, hit me one more time. All right, Dupless. I'll hit you. Oh, the, the P just added itself back in. It's called Spike Shield. Oh, okay. So if you find that, then I'd suggest it. Spike Shield. Okay, okay. I'll keep that in mind. Dupless. Done. There you go, buddy. <laughs> He's so shocked. Wha what? What did you just say? It can't be! Those graphics, though. <laughs> the spin effect. Oh my god. No, why? How? I'm feeling faint. Bye, Mario. Fake Mario. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Is he going back to Creepy Steeple? Did I, I did not just go, like, three times back and forth to Creepy Steeple just to follow you back there. Oh my god. Alright, let's go get our body and name back. Yo, 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 Millers, welcome on in. Welcome back to the dojo. How you guys doing today? We're playing some Paper Mario, trying to take on this boss whose name we just found out is Dupless. What a silly name. Let's roll under this log here. There we go. You should restock. Restock on what? I, like, almost never use items. Uh, so here, wait, if we're not using that, uh, soft stomp badge, though, I can take that off. And put back multi-bounce. There we go. Down the pipe! Uh, I haven't needed HP stuff in battle before, and if I desperately need it, I do have sweet treat, so I can heal myself with that. Uh, but yeah, I never really often had HP items. Okay, you're just gonna come right back to me. Can you walk the opposite direction? Like... Go that way? Yeah, a little more, a little more. You suck, flower! Oh, okay, I walked right into him. My fault. Okay. Burn you. Why? Let's go, let's go. Okay, that one's gone, and that one's gone. Cool, we get one star piece for winning a battle that we barely even fought. Cool. Oh, and they don't even drop anything. That's lame. Yeah, I think it'll be fine, Chad. We'll, we'll go for it. We'll see what happens. I cannot see myself behind the tree. Flowey, move to the right. That's it. Keep going, keep going. No, not to the left. Come on, AI, move to the right. You can do it. Oh my god, he's taking like two steps at a time. A little more, a little more. God dang it. Maybe I should just walk towards him if he keeps going left. This is a really bad spot to be in. Ah, oh, god dang it. We're like trapped here. Oh wait, here we go. We can make a little bit of distance. Better. Now quit walking to the left. Oh my god. To the right. To the right. To the right. Please go to the right so I can get past this battle. Uh, oh my god, I made it past him. That was risky. Hey, Punk, what's up, Goaded? Welcome on in. How's your Wednesday going? Uh, I don't think I can make it past this flower yet. He's literally standing right over me. Okay, a little bit of extra distance. We're almost past him. The only reason I'm doing this hiding on and off is because I'm trying to avoid the battle at all costs, because I just really don't want to battle these things. A little further, a little further to the right. Ah, come on. Go to the right. There you go. Perfect. And we're home free. Let's go. All right, back to Creepy Steeple. We got a boss fight brewing, folks. It's coming. Gotta jump in the hole. I wonder if we have to go all the way back up the tower. No, you do not. Don't fall asleep on me, please. Okay, that works too. Here we go. I do need $350 for the first part. You are correct. I need $350 fundraised by this Sunday, September 26th, in order to advance to Phase 2 of Rescue Royale. As you guys can see right over there, in the middle of the screen, we've raised $140 so far. So, if you guys want to help give me a chance to compete in an eSports arena out in Las Vegas in a Fall Guys tournament, all you gotta do is go to this link in chat. 
and donate however much you are willing to donate. All of this, all the proceeds go directly to the Red Cross and help families in need. Did I save? We're gonna save again just to be safe. Jade, welcome on in. Welcome, welcome. So you are right, Goaded. I do need 350 for the first part. I just made the fundraiser goal 500 because uh, even though we need 350 by this Sunday, by next Saturday we need 500. Yeah, if I'm lucky, I'll get to meet all the uh, the really good Fall Guys gamers out in uh, out in Vegas. But not only do I have to fundraise the $500, I also have to make it through two preliminary tournaments or two two preliminary uh, like mini comps. Okay, the stairs should still be in the right spot. No, they're not. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. So only top 115 competitors make it to phase two, which is the uh, the mini comp part two on October 2nd. And only the top 20 competitors from October 2nd will be flown out to Vegas to compete on October 16th. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're gonna save again, because why not? To be an extra precautious. Up the tower we go. Give this Dupliss a piece of our mind. Or I wonder if he went down to the parrot. It would be pretty funny if we went all the way up and he went all the way down. You have pretty good odds? Well, I don't know. I'm definitely going to try my hardest, but there are a lot of good competitors in here. Ah, uh, he is up here. Hey, you again, Slick? Shad, thank you so much for the $10 donation to Rescue Royale. That puts us at 150 we are officially $200 away from our goal for Sunday. There you go, now the uh, the counter updated. Thank you so much, Shad, I appreciate the support. I'll be fighting for all y'all in the dojo squad when I get out there. You're pretty stubborn to follow me all the way here. Fine, fine, I see, I get it. Let's just put an end to this, shall we? All right, kids, put on your fighting gloves. Woohoo, it's a me. Oh God, sure thing, Mario. No, they're using my own allies against me. Oh shit, we're right there with you. This creep couldn't take us on his own, so he teamed up with a Shadow Siren. Well, we certainly won't be letting him do anything to our little Mario. Revered, you're gonna taste the pain, Gonzalez style. Oh, you're gonna taste the pain, Gonzalez style, Shadow guy. Very good, my loyal ones. Yes, because this is definitely how Mario talks to his friends. How dare this nameless nobody challenge the great Mario! Mario? The guy who stole your name and body is Mario? That means you're Mario! Yeah, actually. <laughs> I can't believe it! All this time I was helping Mario, I feel like an idiot! For those who have not played this game before, Vivian is supposed to be evil, but then she started helping us because she didn't know who we were. <laughs> What's going on here, huh? Fight with your girlfriend? Well, don't expect any sympathy from us, ghoulies! Battle time! Oh god. Oh, he's got Goombella on his team! Oh no! Yeah, yeah, yeah. See? Your friends ditch you because you don't have the charisma of me, Super Mario! Cannot do this fight. Alright. Wait! I don't even get Vivian helping me? Oh, crap. Okay. Well, at least we know how much health Mario, fake Mario has. Duplets. But I don't know if we're supposed to attack Goombella as well. Can I? I can attack Goombella. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Let's go, let's go. Probably should have used a stronger attack than just that bounce, but it's fine. We'll learn. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, I definitely need to be doing more damage. Um, do I have anything that can affect them? Softens up enemies for a bit, decreasing their defense. I don't know what his defense is, but that's not what I want. Um, got FP, FP. Uh, sure, we'll boost my defense. Why not? That'll probably help. Okay, one hit. Better than nothing. Should be zero. Yes, let's go. Oh, what's up with the multi bounce, Bella? I'm I'm sorry, sis. This Mario is the only person who's ever been kind to me. <gasps> Vivian's gonna help? Yes, Vivian's here to help. Mario, I'm fighting by your side from now on. Let's go. She's officially a good guy now. I've I've made my choice, and I'm not turning back. Let's freaking go. She don't want to help the enemy, I guess? Not anymore, Shad. She changed her mind. 
Alright, let's get some... Ooh, what do we want? Strike an enemy by knocking it into the enemy behind it. Power smash hammer a single enemy using a lot of attack power. I think I want to do that. What? Oh, no, we don't need to use fire drive because Vivian can set people on fire. The audience gave us a mushroom. Awesome. Bunny damage all ground enemy. Let's do power smash. One, two, three. Let's go. And we get the backflips. Oh, crap. The set fell on us. <laughs> The plot thickens, that it does! Alright, set Mario on fire. There you go, enjoy the burning flames of hell, Mario. Dodge! Ah, oh, dang it. Alright, that's fine. As long as we're only taking one hit of damage, we're good. I don't want to attack Umbella. I would feel bad hurting my friends. Uh, do we do another one of those, or do we do multi-bounce? Jump on all foes in a row. No, I want to do spin jump. Cool. And we'll set him on fire again. Does that do double fire damage now? If only. Oh, do we get another mushroom? Do we get full health back? Hey, let's go! That's two bingos this stream! That's awesome, dude! That's like the most bingos I've ever gotten. Oh, oh also, I bet you this boss battle will level Mario up, because we only need 10 points left. Mario, don't let your guard down, okay? Yeah, I'm sure he won't. Oh god, oh god. Alright, well, we dodged the second one. Kind of. Nice, nice, nice. Let's go. Alright, so we're gonna do... Power Smash! Okay, so that did six damage. So that is better than the, uh... The Spin Bounce, or Spin Jump, whatever it is. Okay, whatever just fell completely missed me, so that's good. Uh, I have a bad feeling all these attacks are gonna miss in the fog. Oh, alright, that hit. That's good. Maybe since she moves through the shadows, she can see in the fog. Oh, how dare you try to do this to the great Super Mario! How dare you! Oh, dang, he got me. Oh, my defense is, uh, back, back down. Okay. That's fine, we're almost done with him anyway. He's only got six health left. One more power smash and he's done for. Oh, crap! What? Did I release too early? Oh no, the fog. The fog made me miss. Duh. Okay. I was gonna say, that should've hit. One more attack and he's done for. I've almost had it. Super Mario's hurting! I'm gonna switch out and make me fight all my friends? Is that what's gonna happen here? Nice miss, Goombella. Love to see it, love to see it. Yeah, I, I definitely think I'm gonna level up. Um... We should be able to just do a normal hammer to finish him off, can't we? Yes, we can. Goodbye, Dupless. No, why? How? You dead, and I didn't have to hurt my friends a single time. Mario! Oh, yeah, we're definitely leveling up. Let's go. 21 points. Let's go, let's go! Level up, I believe. We are gonna give our level up to some badge power. Get some more badge power going. There we go. Dupless is back to his normal self. Huh? Our teammates had no idea. And we get our body, our soul, and our name back. Let's go. Going to read. See you later. Alrighty, Millers. You have a great night. Robbie and Fiona, it was good to see you guys. Enjoy your bedtime stories. Wrapped, you killjoys. Oh, he's gone. We didn't even beat him. What? He ran away. I mean, wait, just what the heck is going on here? That wasn't the real Mario? Did we get shellwinkled? <laughs> shellwinked? Oh, like hoodwinked, shellwinked? Okay. I see. <laughs> How could I ever mistake my dear Mario for another? Oh, silly flurry. So, who's this girl, huh? Isn't she one of the shadow sirens you guys mentioned? Why would Gonzalez pair up with one of those creeps? Well, I, uh... Defend her, Mario. She's on your team. She saved you. Oh, Mario, thanks for sticking up for me. Well, thanks to her, I guess you came through this okay. No sweat, right? Uh, listen, Mario. Sorry about earlier. I'd be happy to travel with you if you'll have me. Yes! Vivian has really joined the party now! Let's go! What do we have, five party members? Oh, and she presents us with the crystal star. This is for you! 
Crystal star number four. Let's go. Three crystal stars left to grab. Let's go, dude. Chad just earned the 5k bits badge. Oh my god, Chad, have you all really donated 50 bucks worth of bits? That's insane. Thank you so much. Congrats on your bits badge. Congrats. And your number one for the month. You got that top bit donator badge. Mario defeated the rogue who had stolen his name and appearance. Now Mario has four crystal stars. That leaves a mere three more to find. And that means his quest to collect all the crystal stars is more than half over. Now Mario heads off toward his next adventure with his new friend Vivian. But what about Beldum and Marilyn? What and what became of the doppelganger Duplice? Will Duplice reappear later in the game? Hmm. Interesting, interesting. Now you can add a new bit emote? Oh, you're right, I do have, need to add more bit emotes. I never thought anyone would get that high. <laughs> I think you and Ferris are still the only one that have the 5k bits badge. Vivian is so very late. Where has that scatterbrain been all this time? Hey, Allie, welcome back. How was your shower? Did you get off your butt and get all nice and clean? Uh-oh. They're gonna rope in Duplice as their third now that I took Vivian. That's not good. Back to Peach. I thought I usually had a Bowser segment before Peach. Weird. Are you sure about this? Speak up, x not Yes, sir. Quite sure. I poured over all our research of the Thousand Year Door, and it appears the ceiling power has definitely been weakening, as Beldum said. Finally, the treasure of legend, the ancient power of darkness, will soon be ours. Listen and listen well. Keep giving the Crystal Star search top priority. Of course, that also includes the elimination of Mario, that meddling scum. Got it, sir. Yeah, now I gotta take out what I'm bringing with me. Oh, you gotta pack for your trip? Yeah, that's uh, something you gotta do. Have fun with that. Make sure you don't overpack. <laughs> soon I will have the power that has slept for a millennium. So very soon. And when that glorious day dawns, I'll throw the world into the depths of terror. No one can stop me now. All will kneel before the x not regime. And I, Grotus, will build a new world. A perfect ideal world. Yes, a world made by... Ugh, I can't speak. I can't speak. A world made by me. About me and for me. Uh-oh. Smock, yo, what's up? Do you want to play in the Fight Club 2v2 with me at 7? Kudos, Torny. Uh, I would, but I always do variety games on my Wednesdays. I, uh, my, my Wednesdays are on my, always my variety Wednesday stream. So, I'm doing Paper Mario. I would love to, but unfortunately, I, uh, don't have the, uh, the time to compete in the, the, the Fight Club tournaments on Wednesdays. Next time, maybe. It, maybe, uh, uh, if we plan and around it, and I take a week off of Paper Mario or whatever variety game I'm doing, we can do, a another 2v2, uh, another 2v2 Fight Club. I'd be down for that, but yeah, not tonight. Sorry, Smock. We're definitely on for practicing Saturday, though. Guys, if you don't know who Smock is, go give him some love. He's a fellow Fall Guys competitor, and we are going to be competing with him in the Juicy Mania tournament coming up. Uh, the original date for it was October 9th, but it might get pushed. I'm not sure. Just stay tuned. We will definitely be competing in that, though. Now go give Smock some love. Give him some follows. Tech, did you call me? Now we get some Princess Peach. What shall I do today? Will it be dancing, perhaps? Disguising? Or will I sing a song or something? I... I am conflicted. Huh? Tech is taking a long time to answer. What's wrong, Tech? You don't seem yourself. Which is more important? Carrying out an order or protecting a critical person? I exist for the purpose of a certain person. I wish to exist for the purpose of another. I do not know what to do, really. What do you mean? No, never mind. Please forget my musings. I think Tech is in love with Princess Peach. I do not know why, but it makes me feel unpleasant if I make you worry. Well, in any case, let's have a quiz. <laughs> a quiz? Great, we get, we get to take some tests while Mario is out trying to save our ass. That's right, Princess Peach, please answer the questions that I'm about to ask you. If you cannot answer five questions, you may use the communicator as usual. Oh, if you can, if you can answer. It is done. <laughs> oh, did you give Smock a follow? Thank you, Shad. 
What's with all? What's with you all of a sudden, huh? Now the first question: What will happen if you collect seven crystal stars? The thousand-year door opens. Correct. Now the second question. Thank you, Shad. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate you spreading some love within the Fall Guys community. What is the goal of Grotus, leader of the X-Nots? To conquer the world, to get rich, to become a superhero. I mean, I guess technically he's trying to conquer the world, but he did just tell us he's trying to make his own world. So technically he's not trying to conquer this one. He's trying to make his own world that he can conquer. Shad with another hundred biddies! Thank you so much, Shad. You have been extremely generous this stream, and I cannot thank you enough. Your support means the world. Correct. Now the third question. What is the legendary treasure that awaits behind the thousand-year door? I have no idea. Tech, is this? Princess, please answer. What is the legendary treasure that awaits behind the thousand-year door? A hundred million coins, definitely. An extremely rare badge or a thousand-year-old demon soul? I'm going to say demon soul. Correct. Hey, let's go. Now the fourth question. What does Sir Grotus wish to do with this ancient demon soul? Uh, cherish it always, bring the demon back to life, hang out with it. Probably bring the demon back to life. Correct. Now the fifth and final question. What is required to seal up the demon again? Oh crap. Uh, crystal stars? Correct. <laughs> you have correctly answered all five questions. Now you may use the communicator. Sweet, she gets to send an email to Mario. Tech, you... Was it okay for you to tell me such things? Please input the message you wish to send. Tech's being very weird with her. I've been gone so long and you deserve all the support. Shad, you do not need to throw all this money my way. Just being here and hanging out with me is enough. But I do greatly appreciate it. Uh, okay. I'm done. Could you send it? Alright, what email are you sending Mario this time, Princess Peach? The message has been sent. That is all for now. Please go back to the room. Hey, okay, bye, Tech. You've been really weird today. Thank you. You're still a weird computer, Tech. Yeah, I agree. I agree, Peach. Tech is a very weird computer. Good night, Princess Peach. I also think it's really weird that Tech always says that after she leaves the room. Alright, time for Bowser? Maybe? Uh, well, last we fought Bowser was... We had to take the blimp. Yeah, there he is. Okay, cool. My lord, I've received reports of a great secret in the floating town of Glitzville. Let's ride the cheap blimp there now. Come on. You there. Two tickets. One great and evil king, and one sweet young thing. Good gravy. B Bowser, the evil king, and a deluded old hag. <laughs> Life's too short. He's gonna run away. Yep. Bye, dude. Wait, he just ran onto the train tracks. That is not safe. Wh what did he just say? Hey, come back here, you. You impotent little cheapskate. I guess uh, no one really sees her as a young thing. Hey, I'm talking to myself. Where'd Lord Bowser go? Did he take the train? Or did he just go to the blimp by himself? Or does he have a Bowser? Oh, he's got his little clown car. All right. I see you, Bowser. <laughs> Forget that wimpy blimpy. I'll be riding this baby. I snuck into Glintsville once before, so I know the way. No problemo. You go easy on your old limbs and take the slow ride on the blimp, Grandma. Goodbye, Grandma. <laughs> That's great. I kind of figured this uh, clown car was coming up. Oh no, he got rid of a broom. Wait, Lord Bowser, please. Aw. Now my special... What? It... Dirigible Deluxe Brown Bag Cami Lunch will go to waste. I don't know, okay, I don't know what that line means about, but alright. There goes Bowser, floating on up to Blitzville. Wind flowing in his hair. Uh-oh. Oh no, he's not gonna make it! Huh? Oh, I skipped this text. Damn it. Bye! Have fun landing on your head and getting some brain damage. Or is he gonna land in the water? Oh, he's landing in the water, okay. Rip, do we have to go rescue him? I really hope we don't. Oh no, we're in world 2-1, Oh crap. 
Why did Bowser have to be in the water level? Jesus Christ. Okay. Let's break some blocks. Don't touch me. Oh, and I can throw fire underwater. Amazing. What happens if I break you? Oh, we get a badge or something. Now that. Oh, go up, go up! What? I was spamming the X button. You wouldn't go up. I guess I was stuck in the fire breathing animation. Let's try that again, shall we? Oh, we can actually, like, destroy anything. Oh, we made Bowser bigger. Nice. Can I get even bigger? Yes! Ultra Bowser, let's go! Go, Bowser, go! Wait, I want to destroy what's underneath me. Oh, I lost star power. Dang it! How do I get back? Hang on. I'm gonna turn around here. Dang it! I got shrunk. Now I'm not. There we go. Oh, I guess I don't get double star power. <laughs> Fine. We just keep going now. Those x knots are dead. But we can bounce up here. Boing! Where does this put me? Oh, we made it to World 2 Dash. No, we were in World 2 Dash 2. What the? Get the flagpole! Oh, I destroyed the flagpole. <laughs> Let's go! We did it! Bowser beat World 2 Dash 2! <laughs> Finish! That was great. I love these in between Bowser levels. They're so funny. Do, do, do. Oh, that transported him back here. Alright, back in Rome Port. I wonder if now we'll be able to unlock the uh, fast travel with those ports. That was terrible. I gotta get in shape. Whoa, it's Bowser the Koopa King. He'll eat us. Someone help. Runaway time. Oh my god. She, what? She went to Glitzville and got all the memorabilia. <laughs> there you are, Lord Bowser. What are you doing here? I've been looking all over. If I may ask, where have you been, your sogginess? Swimming. Really? Neat. As for me, Glitchville was fantastic. The fights were so cool. I was overcome. Why, even at my age, I was shaking what my mama gave me. And then, the hot dogs. Oh my gracious, yummerly. You have fun too, right? Uh, I do not think he had fun. Oh, he destroyed a pole again. Lord Bowser, is that a no? It was terrible, you hear me? I swallowed a dang blooper. I wanted to have fun. But forget it, it's over. Go get me some solid info on Princess Peach and the Crystal Stars now. Okay, looks like that's the end for Bowser here. Well, I gotta go, but wish you good luck with the stream. I'll try and tune in again. Thank you so much for popping in, Chad. And thank you so, so much for not only 800 biddies, but the $10 donated to Rescue Royale. I appreciate it so much. We're gonna do one last shout out. For Shad, if you guys are not currently following her, go give her a follow. She's a really, really entertaining streamer. Alright, this should put us back into Rogueport now. Goodbye, Bowser. We can see if we have any... Oh, we're still here. Okay. Uh, but when we do get back to Rogueport, we can see if there's any new tasks from the, uh, the townsfolk. I can't believe it was a fake Mario all that time, so we were all fooled. I'm so sorry, I'm so, I'm so sorry, Mario. After all you've done for our town, did we hurt your feelings? Eh, maybe a little. <laughs> er, well, alright, it's okay to be in touch with your feelings. So then, you've brought a shining ray of light on, to our dim little town. Twilight Town thanks you. Hey, Mario, we need to get back to Rogueport, right? Let's go. Please come back to visit anytime you'd like. Goodbye. Let's go. Alright, that is the end of Twilight Town for now. We're gonna have to eventually go back just uh, so we can get some of those, uh, what is it? The, the, the gold flower, we need to tattle some other enemies. Let's see what Princess Peach sent us, what kind of email we got. My dear Mario, I have finally learned what the legendary treasure is. It is the spirit of a demon. The x knots plan to revive the thousand-year-old monster and use its power to take over the world. They're collecting the crystal stars so they can open the thousand-year door. They'll find this demon spirit but the only thing that can keep it locked away is the crystal stars themselves. You must not let them get the crystal stars. 
Please, Mario, you must put a stop to their horrible plans. Princess Peach. And ancient demon spirit. Oh boy, do we have the power to destroy this yet? No, no we do not. I think I need a hammer upgrade for that. There's also this X on the ground here that I still don't know what it does. Oh, maybe we can hide in the ground? I don't know. Let me try that. You gotta go too, Alley. All right, y'all have a great night. We'll see you maybe on Friday. Enjoy your, your flight home. Fly safe. See you soon, Alley. All right, let's do Super Hammer. One, two, three, four, five, six, go! Nice. Uh, we can just normal hammer him and then we're done. There we go! Battle complete! Only one measly start point. That's a shame. So, what happens if we hide here? Nothing? Alright, still don't know what this X marks the spot is for. Nope, no you don't, no you don't. Let's go, up we go. She put us back in Rogueport, right? Yeah, there we go. In Rogueport we are. Was something hidden back there? It looked like there was maybe something hidden. I want to go back and check. Anything here? Nope. Uh, I guess not. Nope. Nothing. All right. Just thought I saw something. Figured it'd be worth checking. Let's see what kind of tasks we have. I forget what they're called. They're not tasks. They're uh, there's something to do with the problem the town has. I thought I was supposed to be able to get this after chapter. Four. Maybe it was after chapter five when Beard said I could get this. I got another email. What do we get? Uh, uh, hello. Where be my email? There we go. Kapook, hide and seek. What's up, Koops? After you found me, I found a nice hiding nook at a place called Goomstar Temple. It's so cold, my shell is frosty, but it's a great place for hiding. Obviously, I don't want anyone to find me, but the thing is, I do want people to see how good I am at hiding. You see the bind I'm in? Anyway, spread the word. Come find the wandering hide and seek Koopa. See you later, or not. Yours, Koopoo. All right, so they are in Goomstar Temple. I don't think we've made it to Goomstar Temple yet. I don't know where that is. Do I have a map? Is there a map I can open? Um. I guess not. I thought there was a map I could open. Let's see what kind of uh, quests we got on the board here. Troubles. The troubles. Right, right, right. Okay. So, Mayor Krupp, will someone please come talk to me, please? I'm waiting at the pink house in Petalburg. I thought I already talked to this dude. I definitely already did that one. Okay, what else do we have? Oh, there's a lot of them. Wow, alright, alright. Puny Elder Emergency Shroom. I'm getting up there in here, so I want some life insurance, a life shroom. I'm in no big hurry. Okay, do I have a life shroom? Let's see, do we have a life shroom on us? I have a mushroom, an ultra, I don't have a life shroom. We can see if I can buy one, but let's uh, hold off on that for right now. What is this one? Play with me. The Pianta Parlor is now having its grand opening event. Wee! Whoever takes this request gets something special from Lala, the cute kitty boo. Cool, let's go do this. I thought I had done this one too. Maybe I didn't. I don't know, but we're gonna do this one. This one's nice and easy. Plus, on our way over to uh, West Roadport, we can check the shop to see if there's a life shroom. Then we can buy that, and once we finish this trouble, we can take Puny Elder's trouble and go give it to him. Let's check the shop. We have a life shroom in here. What's this? Super Luigi, Super Luigi 64, Super Luigi Book 1, super popular, now on sale. What does this get us? I want this. I don't know what it is, but I want it. Uh, is that put it in my gear? Super Luigi, what is this? Oh my god, this is like an actual book. What the frick? Have you ever experienced a time when no matter how hard you tried and you failed, and the time you spent felt wasted? 
If you ever feel such pangs of regret, try to remember this tale. The story of a young man's quest to save a sweet princess. Super Luigi, Volume 1. How long is it? Oh, it's not that bad. It's only 12 pages. To be continued. I gotta buy all the Super Luigi books. Oh, God. All right. And do you have a life shroom? Uh, I'm here to buy... Wait, no. Don't you have a catalog or something? Oh, no. The catalog's only for the bad shop. Okay. Well, okay. At least we bought some Luigi book. That's kind of cool. We gotta keep our eyes peeled for more volumes of that. Figure we can, uh, we can read them all in one fell swoop once we buy them. Okay, two Pianta Parlor. Alright, Lala. I'm here for your trouble. Hit me with them coins. Hi, hello there, Mario. Welcome to the parlor. Oh, you took my trouble. That is so super. Well, okay, here's your special thing. Ten coins. Don't tell anybody. What's the matter? You look disappointed. Well, fine. Whatever. Enjoy the parlor. Play and win. Okay, that was an easy trouble. Uh, we'll come back. I want to save coins for a later date and time when we come back to do the parlor. Okay, so now, all the way back over, uh, we do not have a new trouble. Can I get over this fence? Can't get through it. Can't get over it. That is a no-go. Alright. So we're not going to take Puny Elder's request yet. I want to try and find a life shroom somewhere in my travels, and then I'll come back and accept it. Uh, but for right now, there's no point in taking it. So let's see what other troubles are there. Got Pine T Jr. Help my daddy. Oh, my dad is in a world of hurt down there. Please, you got to help him. I'm waiting at the entrance of the Pit of 100 Trials. Okay, that's going to be a no. Crap, that's not what I meant to do. Uh, so we're not doing the Pit of 100 Trials, we'll do that all at the end. Jolene wants help. Need some help. I need some cleaning done. Motivated workers only. Please meet me in the Glitz Pit. I thought we did cleaning too. This must be another cleaning one. Alright, we'll take Jolene's. Let's head up to the Glitz Pit. We'll do some cleaning there, and then back over to Rogueport. Uh, I do want to check the docks real quick. One, to see if Bowser's there, because he was just there when we were playing as him. And two, to see if that green weasel dude will give me my money back yet. And if he's not there, uh, we do not have enough coins to donate a third time, so can't really do anything. Or if he is still here, I mean. Okay, he's gone, so we can't donate to him anymore, but after the next chapter, he should reappear. Okay, cool. Good to know, good to know. Okay, now let's head back to West Roadport. That's not what I meant to do. Oh, this dude's got some uh, shop stuff. Jump man, increase your jump power by one, lose your hammer ability. That's weird. Alright, stopwatch. Temporarily immobilizes enemies. That's pretty cool. I like that. Well, I'll keep him in mind. I forgot he was a shop. Alright, let's take that blimp. See what Bowser was looking for up in the glitz pit. We got our tickets. Let's go. I would assume uh, chapter 5 we're going to be taking that train. I don't know about chapter 6 and 7 though. Off we go. Taking the blimp. wonder if there's anything new here. Bowser was talking about some kind of secret. Got some delicious hot dogs over there. What happens if we answer the phone? Anything new here? Local time is snack time. Luigi! Guess we just get calls from everywhere. Alright, nothing new there. Uh, what do we got in here? Any uh, life shrooms? What is this? It's a super shroom. Actually, how much is that? 10 HP? It's 
not a bad deal. I might want to get that. What items do I have stored right now? Okay, let's uh, we'll say we're here to store then. Okay, we've got a mushroom, a slow shroom. Are these these are the things I can store? Right, all right. So let's store the golden leaf. We'll need that for uh, for cooking at a later date in time. Now we can try and withdraw and see what's in there. Okay, we got three golden leaves in there. Not bad, uh, but no. No life shrooms. Alright, let's buy this, because this is definitely worth it. Actually, let's buy two. Cool, alright, now we have items that can heal us when we need it. That's good. We're definitely gonna save after that one. Actually, you know what? We'll save after we do the trouble. There's not gonna be any battling to do here. Plus, even if we do somehow get into a battle, uh, even if we lose, we don't, like, game over. We don't die. Let's get around back. Of course, you gotta open the door to the Great Gonzales, right? we go. Okay, last time we did this, uh, I'm pretty sure we cleaned up before we even talked to her, so let's do that again. Pretty sure she wants us to clean up the storage room. Yeah, look at this, got all these dirty battle trunks in here. I definitely already did this trouble, so I feel like it repeated itself. Cool, alright, up the steps. Got some more dirty trunks up here. Oh, gotta switch out our party member real quick. For a beard. There we go. Nice. Alright, any in here? No battle trunks in here. Got it. That should be all of them then. Alright, let's go talk to Jolene and see what she thinks of all our hard work. Alright, let's go talk to her. There she is, Miss Jolene. Yes, who is that? It's customary to knock before entering. Oh, it's the great Gonzalez. Okay, I don't think we need to read her text. She's gonna be like, yeah, thank you for doing the trouble. What? You want to unretire and battle again? Uh, I do not want to do that. That is, is not something I want to do, but we definitely already talked with her about this, which is why I'm confused why we had to do this one again. I guess it didn't save. But it definitely did, because we were still in Chapter 4 when, uh, when we loaded up the game today. I'm confused why this task is repeating itself. Alright, so she's going to put us in the minor room, yada yada yada. Except you're in trouble, yes. What, you already did it? Whoa, good job. Here, have something. Wait. You smell terrible. Oh, you don't still have that garbage on you, do you? You have to take that stuff far away from here. I can't stand it. I know of a Goomba named Goomfrey in Rogueport that buys stuff like that. I've already gotten in touch with him, so just get out of there. Uh, get the trash out of here. Alright, so we gotta look for Goomfrey in Rogueport. Got it. Goomfrey in Rogueport. I think it went the wrong way. I did, that's fine. It's fine, we're just taking the long way around. It's all good. Back to Rogueport. Here we go, back in the blimp. There it comes. Get us in there. There we go. Bye bye, Glitzville. Nice to see ya. Cool, cool. All right, we are back. Now we gotta find Goomfrey. Uh, I don't know where in Rogueport this person is, but we will find them. I'm gonna guess it's some Goomba somewhere based on the name. What, uh, what is this dude's name? 
Are you Goom Free? Ah, uh, how refreshing. Life feels so simple. Yep, you're not the noob. Goodbye. What about you? Are you Goom Free? Uh, no, you are not Goom Free. Are you Goom Free? Uh, nope. Alright. What about back here? Is there a Goom Free hiding back here? Is this dude. Uh, I don't remember what his name is. I guess he doesn't have a name. Uh, anyone back? Oh, we got a Goom Free back here. Do you buy dirty stuff? Listen, this is a huge secret, but I don't mind telling you. I'm a wanted Goomba. What? I'm not wanted by anybody. Really? Hey, that dude's not him. I just saw a cockroach. Can I destroy the cockroach? Guess not. I tried. I tried. Okay, so no Goom Freak here. Where could this person be? There's not another. Oh, there is another Goomba here. No, that's the same Goomba. Alright. Where is Goom Free? Check back here. Uh, but I don't think either of you guys are Goom Free. What about you? Ah, here he is. Yeah, I spoke to Jolene. Now, who was it that she wanted to take care of? No, no, she wants you to take care of these dirty items. Alright, just gotta spam this and give them all the trunks and then we'll be done. I think I have to go back to Jolene after this and let her know that I'm finished. Kinda sucks. You're almost there, almost there. Four more. Three more. Two. And final one. Alright, let's go all the way back to Glitzville and let Jolene know we finished. Yeah, I definitely remember doing this exact one before. We should, uh, next time, when we come back to Rogueport after this, we'll check the board and see if there was another task from Jolene, because this is definitely a duplicate task. Just a blimp. All right, let's go. Here, we'll run with Rubyard. Revere makes us run a little bit faster. And we'll go in the left door again. That is closer to the office. Alrighty, Jolene, we're done with your dumb task. And we got 30 coins for our efforts. Nice. I guess we won't be getting the smell of that room anytime soon. No, nope, uh, smell's on you. Sorry, I ain't helping with that. Uh, it looked like there was something I could interact with. Hey, we got a star piece. Nice. Can I open the other drawer? Maybe? Uh, yes? Nothing. Alright, well, at least we got a star piece. Better than nothing. Alright, back down to Rogueport. I love running on Yoshi. So much faster. Alright. Finally back in... Out of Glitzville. Hopefully we do not have to fly back here over and over and over again. Because I've already done it, what, four times now? I don't know. That's enough flying. No more blimp traveling.
gonna message someone on Discord really quick. Run to the opposite side of Roadport. Alrighty, let's check this trouble board and see if we actually did repeat that task, because I definitely remember finishing it. I guess not. That's the only one from Jolene, but. I feel like I had definitely done this one. Heartful cake recipe. I want to make a heartful cake. I thought I did this one too. Food I want. And the bad craving for a certain food item can please fetch it for me. Okay, I thought I did that one as well. Um, elusive badge. I'm after an elusive badge. Must explain in person. Meet on the roof of Zesty's house in Roadport Square. Closer is anonymous and maybe dangerous. Uh, you know what? We'll try that one. Why not? Okay, Zesty's place. I know how to get there. Just gotta go back into Central Road Port. And through the inn. Luigi! How'd you get here, bro? Well, I headed to Circuit Break Island and got me the marvelous compass piece. You wouldn't believe it, bro. Talk about thrills, chills, and spills. It was pretty nuts, bro. Want to hear what happened? It's a pretty long story. Sure, we'll, we'll listen to your story, Luigi. Sounds good to me. Which part of my story do you want to hear, bro? Waffle Kingdom lever, letter Rumble Bump Volcano. Is that supposed to be like the Grumble Volcano from Mario Kart? Blunt Belly Village and Circuit Break Island. Let's hear about Circuit Break Island. Well, like I said, it's a really long story, but here goes. Just as our boat arrived at Circuit Break Island, we heard this incredible racket. We soon found out that they hold cart races almost every day on the island. Oh, all right. Whoever takes first place in this race gets to rule the island as king for that day. Just as we got to the racetrack, they were holding the award ceremony. I couldn't believe my eyes. Right there on the trophy they give to the winner, it was another piece... Another piece of the Marvelous Compass! I almost passed dead away! I decided right then and there that the only thing to do was enter the next race. I mean, I've driven in kart races before, so I thought I'd be okay, but boy was I wrong. The carts were supercharged machines that could send you airborne with their exhaust. These vehicles were armed with missiles and bazookas. It was anything goes, bro. Of course, I wanted to get right out of there pronto. These drivers were crazed! But I worked up my courage and signed up anyway. And my race day finally came. I got one of the best cards, the big green number one. I took my position at the start line, the light went green, I stomped the accelerator, and something bad happened. I was in reverse! The big green 01 went rocketing backwards with me yelling. I crashed into the wall behind me hard enough to cut me off mid-screen. In one fell swoop, I dropped into last place and wrecked my racing machine. But it wasn't all bad news. All the other cards crashed because of my maneuver. Once I got in gear and took off, I was the only car left. I won by a country mile, bro. I took the piece off my trophy and added it to the Marvelous Compass. The compass came to life and pointed me toward Jazzafraz Town in the east. Then I heard that voice, Princess Eclair's voice, echoed in my ears again. Oh, my princess, random words would form poetry if spoken by your voice. I will most definitely save you. Just wait for me, Princess Eclair. Oh, sorry about that, bro. Um... So, after that, I got back on my boat, and came back here to Roadport, and that's what's been up with me. Cool, I don't want to hear any more of your story, that was a lot. Yeah, I'm Tork, and don't think for a second this dude's telling the whole story. The only reason I lent him my rig is because he got down on his knees and begged. And what happens? He's in it for one second before he completely totals it. Idiot. I'm not letting this dip out of my sight until he repays me the 5,000 coin repair costs. Yeah, have fun with that, I ain't bailing you out. Can I, uh, can I take your badge? The Captain Skull. Skull. This is the Skull Stone, the lucky charm of my family. I love you, you sparkly thing. It is, it's so fabulous, I wish to give it great big kisses. It never leaves my sight. Never. But what if it did? Can I, uh, look at this? 
No. Can I do this? Hang on, I wanna get on the other side of the Nope, stop, I don't wanna talk to you. And switch to coops. Can I do this? Nope. Alright, let's get in front of the bottles. No, nope, that's not gonna do it. Alright. Uh does Goombella have anything to say about this place? Nope, this is not the main square. We are in the inn. Alright, and Vivian, you're the only one I haven't tried yet, but I don't think you're gonna do me any good. Nope, alright, I have no idea how to get that one. Do you have anything to say? Uh, nope. Alright, let's keep going then. You can always come back and listen to more of Luigi's story later. Oh, oh, Master Mario, haven't you found the princess yet? Hmm, I certainly hope she didn't mean this. meet this syndicate I've been hearing of. Please, don't waste another moment. You must find the princess. You're gonna offer me a bed? Yeah, you're gonna offer me a bed. Cool, alright. Let's figure out what's going on with this tattle. Oh, it's you! I'm Mr. Mustache Cutie. I'm the one with the trouble. I have a, I'm a pretty lucky girl to have a strapping fellow like you take on my trouble. Well, let me get right to it, okay? I've done all I can to find this one elusive badge, but I've failed at every turn. The badge is hidden in Hooktail's lair. I'm sure I'm of that much, I'm sure. I went to check that room after I heard you defeated Hooktail, but nothing. I did hear rumors that to find this badge, one has to use the wind. I have no idea what that means, though. Anyway, look for it, okay, sweetie? Alright, that means we gotta head all the way to, uh, what was that? That was Hooktail Castle? That was the first one, so Petalburg. And then we gotta use Flurry's ability to find some something that's hidden in that room. We'll get some pretty elusive badge. Let's go use our fast travel in the bottom of the sewers here. I can't wait to unlock fast travel for, uh... Worlds 5 and 6. Okay, where are we going? We're going down this pipe. And through this gate. Here. And here we go. Pick that pipe on the right over there. Awesome. And that should deliver us right into Petalburg. Amazing. Let's go over to that castle and grab our elusive badge. There we go, we are in the castle. Alright. Wait. No, we're not. This is the wrong way. Hellberg Castle is the complete opposite way. Forgot about that. All the way through town we go. I think that was the dude who wanted us to cook for him, which we definitely already did. I don't know why that trouble got reset. Oh, you know what? Let's uh, let's check the shop while we're here, see if there's a life shroom for uh, old puny elder there. Just a mushroom. I wonder if that's what he wants, is just a mushroom. All the way back. No, 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 don't touch me. Don't you touch me! Should be here now? Yeah, there's the castle. There it is. I knew where it was. I didn't go the wrong way at the start. What you guys talking about? There we go. All right. Got to get to the final battle room, which uh, we should be able to go this way, right? Yeah, I can go this way. Cool. Who needs flying when you got revered? The little Yoshi dude can just carry me all the way. 
Ah, damn it. One of them got me. Let's do a spin jump on this dude. Um, what do we want? Mini egg. Throw eggs at enemies to shrink them to tiny size. Inhale an enemy and spit it out at another enemy. That sounds pretty cool. We can try gold. Oh, uh, I was supposed to press that at a specific time, not spam it. That was my bad. What do I want? Uh, super hammer? Yeah. Okay, wish that had done a little bit more damage, but that's fine. Let's have you do some ground pounding action. Nice! One down, or two down, one to go. Haha, <laughs> he's dizzy now, let's go. Miss your attack, let's go. You stink, Koopa. Okay, normal hammer should be able to take him down. Here we go! Do 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 do. Oh, welcome on in! Welcome back to the dojo! How have I been? I've been doing swell! We're playing some Paper Mario here, trying to get us further along in the game. We just finished chapter 4 out of 8, so we are officially halfway through. Although I am trying to do everything in there is in this game. I'm trying to 100% it, so... Uh, I guess we're not technically halfway through. <laughs> but how have you been? Welcome on in, Thaw! Uh, let's swap to Goombella. Because I do not know... No, ah, oh, that's not what I meant to do. Dang it. Well, that was a wasted turn. I need to get some info on the flying Koopa there. You're doing well. I'm glad to hear that, Thaw. Glad to hear it. I saw you've been streaming a bunch of other games besides Fall Guys. You're branching out a little bit. What are uh, what are some of the games you've been playing? I should have used my hammer. That would have killed him in one hit. That was kind of dumb. Okay, tattle on you. Okay, we got that info now. Cool, cool, cool. We got entry number 11. Okay. Let's do... Let's use Goombella to kill you. And Mario can do a spin jump. Let's go! Battle complete! Do -do -do -do. Oh god, another battle. Alright, I guess I couldn't avoid this one. I use multi bounce? Yeah. Let's bring them all down. There we go. Oh, one has got a power block. Let's uh, not let him use that. I do multi bomb. Continue bombing foes? Sure, why not? Okay, thought you would do that on multiple foes, but that's fine. More attack. Okay, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? They got three health each. Let's use a super hammer. That might kill them both. Nope, just one of them. Alright, that's fine. Gumbella can kill the other. And he's dead. There we go. We've been playing House Flipper HGTV Cooking Sim. Just die already. <laughs> Phasmophobia, Kill It With Fire, and a few others that you haven't tried yet that you've got in the wings. That is awesome. That is a lot of games you got going there. Oh crap, we gotta drop an item for the POW block. Um, let's get rid of... Dizzy Dial, yeah, sure. I'm gonna switch back to Revere so we can run through this place super quick. Those are some pretty awesome games. I don't think I've actually ever played any of the ones you've mentioned. Uh, but I know like Phasmophobia is a good horror game that a lot of people have liked playing. Cool to see you branching out into other games, though. I hope it's going well for you. I hope you're enjoying them. Get away from me! No touchy. Okay, where are we going? Where are we going? Let's go up? No, I have to go through here. I forget where this battle room was. Oh, hello. This dungeon? Okay, right, I do remember this section. I can't get over the fence. Okay, where does this lead? This leads us to the chest. Oh, okay, there is another door. I really don't remember Hooktail Castle. It's been a long time since we've been here. 
This was just a chest room as well. Oh, is there something here that I'm missing now? All right, Flurry. Work your magic. No? All right, that's not anything. I guess it's not this room. It's wherever we battled Hooktail, which I don't remember where that was, but I guess we're going to have to climb the tower. I think it was probably at the top of the tower, so let's do that. Back through here, and through here. You play Fall Guys just not as often? You didn't and don't want to pigeonhole yourself. Makes sense. Gotcha, I gotcha. As long as you still enjoy the game and you don't get burnt out. That's what it's about, right? Plus, I guess, uh, streaming stuff that your, uh, your community would like. Okay, we need poops on our side here. There you go. Bring us on up. Okay, I have a feeling we're just gonna have to go up all of these floors, so let's do that. Uh, not that way. Let's go through the doorway. Outside we go. Just, you know, hopping out the window is definitely something safe that everyone should be doing when trying to traverse castles. Uh, was this the room we were supposed to be in? I really don't remember the layout of Hooktail's castle. Uh, let's just run from this. I do not feel like fighting these dudes. Do -do 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 -do. God dang it, I lost like five coins there. Activate that bad boy, bring us on up. One more Kupooks hiding out on the left there. We already took care of him. Alright, yeah, this is the right way. We're going the right way. We're good, we're good. No, you don't. Ah, damn it. Alright, we'll fight this one. Ah, uh, we might be able to finish this in one turn. Let's see. Uh, Sheltosh should be able to do this. Ah, crap. Alright, one more turn. There we go. Battle's over. We do have a uh, Koopa coming at us, though. There's one charging us right now, so we gotta move. Ah, dang it. I didn't even have a chance. Okay, uh, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna... We need to Super Smash again. Then, Shell Toss. Hey, you got the style points. Nice. We're gonna do Sweet Treat so we can heal up and try and get some flower power at the same time. Right, that's the best one we got. Power to briefly increase your party's attack and defense. Art attack. Damage all enemies. Oh, damages all enemies you encircle with the star. Interesting. Okay, well, let's do Sweet Treat. Let's heal up a little bit. Dang it. Hit the bad shroom. Alright, there's two out of the three bad shrooms that have passed now. There's one more. There it is. I hit the last one. Damn it. Whatever. Alright, so only three flower power. It's kind of lame. I was hoping for more than that, but we'll take it. Now, Koops. Uh, do you do two or three damage? Let's do a power shell. Or sh yeah, power shell. What? That still did two damage. Oh my god. Poops, you're killing me. Rip. Hey, lucky attack. Let's go. You missed, buddy. Time to jump on your face. Okay. Should be the end of the battles for the time being. We can actually get some... Some, uh, going through the rooms, get some movement done. Oh, yes, look at all those coins. And we got a happy heart. Nice. Alright, let's switch back to Revered. So we can run through this place. Hopefully avoid some battles. Uh, okay, where are we going here? I need to bring that down? I guess I do. Okay, well, I can't use Revered anymore. We gotta switch back to Coops. 
this dude's just gonna follow me, unfortunately. Well, we struck him first, so I guess that works. <laughs> oh, Jesus, there's four of them. Three of them, let's go. Uh, let's... You know what, I'm just gonna jump on one of them. And we'll use poops to attack all of them. Attacks all enemies on the ground. Amazing. There we go. Alright, one more attack from Mario on this dude's thing. Let's go. Jeez. You're gone, and we get a little extra health. Nice. Alright, activate this. Actually, I probably need to activate it a second time. And bring me on up. There we go. Now we get to tread along this line. Can I just go through here? Yes. Oh no, I missed! Ah, crap. That's not how I was supposed to do that. I think I remember how I'm supposed to do it. Gonna go this way with it. There it is. Then we can ride like a paper airplane on over. Perfect. Okay, this is where Hooktail's battle was? No, we still have more stairs. God dang it! The place is so big! Okay, these look like big double doors. This looks promising. Oh, Jesus. Okay, uh, let's switch to Revered. We can run past these dudes. There we go. Juking them! Yeah, this is definitely the way up to Hooktail's battle. Okay. Now we're in the right place. Jesus, castle is so long. Oh, no, no! Oh, god dang it. I did not see that Goomba there. Let's, uh, let's just run away from this one. Bye! Don't want to deal with you. There goes more of our coins. That's fine. Hey, we got a save point. Nice. <coughs> oh, anything back there? Nope. Let's head inside. Alright, there is something hidden in this room. Apparently you need the power of wind to reveal it. Find out where that is. I'm gonna guess it's on the opposite wall first. Okay, nothing there. Nothing. Can I hop out through here? Nope, invisible wall. Alright, anything along here we can blow off? Not seeing anything. Uh, well, the gust of wind is clipping behind this, but I don't think that's it. Okay, a little more challenging than I expected it to be. Nothing here? No? Weird, okay. So where in the world does it want us using this? <coughs> I mean, it says there's a badge somewhere in here. It's not on this wall. Oh, turn around. This corner? No, it just doesn't... I guess this game doesn't like corners. Nothing. Huh. What about the middle of the room? Ah, there we go. Found ya. We got an Attack FXB badge. This badge Miss Meows is looking for. Take it to her. Awesome. Alright, we found the badge. I did not expect it to be in the dead center of the room. But there we go. Now we get to go all the way back down the tower. If only we could teleport. If only. Okay, you're not gonna leave me alone. Let's go, dodge them. Okay, there's gonna be a fast travel down the tower. I'm gonna avoid as many fights as possible. Okay, go. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Good. I wish I could just hop down the stairs here. 
like, uh, just fall over the edge, but fortunately you cannot do that. Gotta take the stairs down. Where does this go, though? This might be a little shortcut for us. Oh, it definitely is a shortcut. Let's go. And is this... Nope, can't walk off that way. <laughs> well, that was actually faster. That, that was helpful. Can drop off here. Nice. What is this room? This is the... Oh, this is this room. Okay, okay. There's a couple fights here we gotta avoid. That dude and that dude. Go, 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 go. Ooh, that was close. Should just be an easy shot to the main room now, I think. I was coming to life in here. Yeah, this is the main room. All right, cool, cool, cool. Now we get to head back to Robeport. head into town and we'll take the shortcut pipe. That way we don't have to go all the way through the sewers, just a little bit. Nope, nope, do not touch me. These buns are not for you to battle. Alright, one more screen and then we can fast travel. Anything in here? Ah, there we go. We got a tartly leaf. Ah, oh, but I can't carry any more things. Alright, we'll just drop it then. Nope, keep keep dropping the turtle leaf. There we go. Rip the leaf. We can come back for it anytime we want, though. Here we go. Back down the fast travel pipe. And over to Rogueport Sewers. <coughs> Through the pipe. Uh, one more pipe and then we should be up. Yeah, one more. Alright, let's see what our next trouble is going to be. Actually, we still have to deliver the badge back to Ms. Meows. Ms. Mouse. I mean, not Meows. That would be a cat. This is a mouse. Over to rest West Road Court. No, not over to West Road Court. She's up here. Up and on up. She should be right over here. Of course, your beard can't get me up. That face. Does it mean you found the badge? Yes, we did. Well, this is certainly the badge I was looking for. Oh, my, yes. Mm -hmm. Now, my sweet. Promise to hear me without getting mad. You see, I was the one who hid that badge. It was a little game of mine. I have to apologize, but I knew you would find it, my handsome cheese hunk. Okay, so she just sent us on this whole wild goose chase for nothing. What the heck? You may even have more badge finding skill than I do. Hmm, I just thought of something. Perhaps I should just tr travel with you from now on. What? Hmm, I'm sure to find lots of badges that way, don't you think? Now about that reward, let's see. Take this badge that you managed to find, but I expect you to lead me to more. Okay, so we get the badge back as our prize. Now let me formally state that you will now enjoy the pleasure of my company. Yo, what? Does Ms. Mouse actually join this, the, the party? Yo, let's go! We got another party member! That's so cool! Ms. Mouse's abilities, her A ability, uh, A primer. I don't know why it always says that. Press X, that is the circle button, and find, and Ms. Mouse will sniff out any items or objects nearby. Okay, that's pretty cool. There doesn't seem to be anything hidden in this area, dearie. When you press X, I'll sniff around and tell you if there are any items nearby. Okay, so obviously there's a chest right in front of me. There's something right near here. If there's something nearby, I'll let you know like I just did now. And battle, I can attack enemies with my love slap. I can also help you out by using the my kiss thief move to steal an enemy's item. Oh, that's pretty cool. 
do 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 You solved the trouble, and I see a star piece. Mind if I do take that real quick? Nice. There should be something somewhere nearby. Well, where? I don't know if by nearby she means, like, within Rogueport or within this area. Like, she's saying there's something near us. I just don't know what or where. It's also hidden, so, like, maybe we can use Flurry to reveal something that's hidden? Maybe. Let's see. Nothing there. Can I blow this dude away? <coughs> nope. What about the cockroach? Guess that doesn't do anything. Okay. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Where could there be something hidden? Can I jump on all this stuff? Nope. Okay, can I do that? No. Okay, that's not gonna do anything. Uh, I don't think there's anything in here, but it doesn't hurt to check again. And this place is nasty, so... Huh. Where could there be some- Oh, you know what she's- oh, okay. It's not actually something hidden. I know what she's referring to. And it's this crate, crate chest, box, whatever you want to call it. It's this one right here that we can't actually get yet. So I uh, can't do anything with that. But uh, we can move over here and use Ms. Mao's and her ability again. Let's see, anything in here? Okay, there's something hidden in this place too. <coughs> I could have sworn I had like picked up everything that, would, that you'd get here, but I guess not. Um, can we use Flurry for anything again? No. Nothing. About back here. I believe there was a star piece we got from here last time. Whoa, who's that? What? How do I get on the roof? Wait, I want to get on the roof. Can I keep moving to the right? I can't tell. Nope, that fell down. I don't think I can get any higher. It's weird. There's definitely some way to get on the roof, though. But let's see if we can find a way on the roof. There's a character up there we haven't seen yet. How do we get on the roof? Oh, there's something above this house. Locked from the inside. Okay, that doesn't help. Let's go back behind. Seems like there's a way on the roof from uh, one of these places over here. Oh, there's a star piece. Yeah, the chimney of this place. We need to get in, in this house to get there. Also, this is the back door of this place, right? This doesn't help us, though. This doesn't get us anything. We've been back there. Uh, what are you doing back here? Were you always here? You're the thief! I remember you. I've got to be straight here. Ishnael told me to wash my hands of thievery. So, I can't be a geologist. I can't be a thief. What should I do? You think? Do I have no talents? Huh, <laughs> that's funny. Okay, what's in here? I forget. What is this place? Say you made it to Twilight Town. We all got problems to deal with, you know? Sure. So how do I get into that locked building? Okay, this place is of no help. I want that star piece, though. I just don't know how to get up there. I don't know if I can get up there. There's also this, fast travel, which we haven't used for anything. Oh, can I... Get over this gap? I wonder if I can. Okay. Probably not, but I'm gonna try once more. Okay, I didn't get the jump off. I'll try one more time. How much health am I losing every time I do this? Not a whole lot. Oh, we can make it! Let's go! Got the shine sprite! And anything else hidden over here? Nope, doesn't seem like it. Okay, let's go back. Nice. Okay. Let's go back through, because it doesn't seem like we can make it onto a roof from here, fortunately. There's definitely a way up from inside this house. I just don't know how to get into the house. What was over here? 
We get no, we couldn't. Oh wait, this dude's on the outskirts. How do you get out there? Oh, 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 oh! We can go this way. Aha! The other day I saw this guy jumping from roof to roof. Man, he was so dashing. But you know, actually, he might have been a bandit. Maybe that's why he was sneaking into chimneys. Yes, okay, so we saw the bandit. We saw the bottom of him on the roof over there, but we, we could not make it over. So, am I supposed to just traverse roofs? I guess I am. Yeah, awesome, we made it. Okay, so, we can get the star piece. Awesome, I thought we were going to have to go in... Oh, we can get in the chimney. All right, all right, hang on. There's a lot to explore here that we just found out. So let's let's get this. And you. Got another shine sprite. Nice. There's nothing else over there. And let's go talk to this bandit dude. And then we'll go back and we'll go inside the uh, chimney. Good afternoon to you, sir. I am called Griffy, the ma traveling minstrel. I spend my days here in leisure, spinning tales that spin the senses. I know but a few of the stories that surround the town of Rogueport. If you like, I can share them with you, but it will, will require just a few coins. Is there a tale you want to hear? These are the tales I can tell you now. Oh, there's a lot to tell me. Uh, alright, I'm good for now, but it's nice to know that we can get up here whenever we want. Let's go in here. Roll on down, We're like Santa Claus. Bust on into this dude's home. What do you blokes want? I have no interest in passing the time with you, so sorry. Now away with you. I don't know why I always put like a, a small southern accent on these people. <laughs> now away with you. Why does he just want me gone? Alright. What's back here though? Oh, we got a secret back room. I'll take that shine sprite. Thank you. Is that all that's in here? Was this whole place just for a shine sprite? God dang it. I feel like there should have been something more than that. Alright, we'll leave you to it then. Goodbye. But we can always go back in here now, right? Yeah, alright, it's unlocked. That's cool. What happens if we go back in the chimney? <laughs> can we go up the chimney? No, we can't get into it. You seriously don't want to talk to us? Nope, he wants nothing to do with us. Alright, let's see what the next, tr uh, next trouble is. We got Mayor Dower Newsletter. Would you please deliver the Silver Club newsletter routing slip for me? Please come pick it up at my house in Twilight Town. Alright, we can do that. An easy one. Just gotta pick it up and drop it off somewhere else. Off to Twilight Town. I gotta remember how to get back there. Think we had to go down in the sewers? Yeah, we have to go down in the sewers in West Rogueport. We'll definitely be starting Chapter 5 next stream. So you guys know what to expect. All right, down in the sewers. Over to the left. There we go. Still can't break open that block yet. Soon. I think after chapter five. All right, now who do we need to talk to here? Not you. Not you. Not you. Nope. Alright, check the houses. Who's in here? Are you the one that wants the newsletter sent? Ah, it is this dude. Mario, you accepted my trouble request. My, my, now that's something. I hope you deliver this Silver Club newsletter routing slip to the Great Tree Elder. Oh, we gotta go to Puny. Okay. Sure. We can do that. Can we read the routing slip? What's up with... What, what, what does this have, huh? Routing slip. A silver club routing slip. It's so well used, it's tattered. Okay, well, can't read anything with it. That's cool. Move on over to uh, the tree, the great forest. I forget what it's called. That's okay. We got fast travel there. Uh, we do need to go into East Rogueport, though. I don't think we can get there from here. Oh, that was a mistake. Oops. Don't touch me. Get in there. There we go. Alright, over to East Rogueport, down into the sewers, and over to the Puny Elder. We have a fast travel pipe we'll be taking. So it'll make it nice and quick. On the pipe. Who doesn't love hanging out in the sewers? Slip through the 
this wall. I can't believe how far we've come. We've actually unlocked a lot of abilities for Mario and his crew. Through there. Oh, dragon. Oh, crap. <laughs> Forgot I can't really jump with Yoshi. Wait, this is the wrong one. Let's go. Now, just put us right outside the tree. Perfect. Now we can give the uh, packing slip or what, routing slip over to the puny elder. There we go. You are not the puny elder. You are Martio. There's your routing slip. Well, this slip needs to go to the Petalberg mayor. Oh, god dang it. Okay, we're going on a wild goose chase here. Off to Petalburg. This one should actually be a lot faster because it's just fast travel pipe to fast travel pipe to Petalburg. Come on, get over the tree. There we go. Alright, over to the other side. And now we're in Petalburg. Easy as that. Quite simple. Alright, so who are we giving this to? We're we giving it to this dude over here? No, that's Koop's father. Um, who are we giving it to? This, this house? Yeah, this guy. Alright. The Silver Club approval slip. Is that from Puny Elder? It is. Since I'm the last one to sign this, it just needs to go back to the Twilight Town Mayor. Alright, awesome. So we are done with the Wild Goose Chase. Just gotta go back to Twilight Town. I love running with Yoshi. It's actually so much faster. It saves a lot of time. Okay, one more pipe to go through, then over to West Road Port, down into the sewers again, and uh, into Twilight Town. go back in East Road Port. I also find it funny that this like extremely tiny Yoshi can hold up Mario's weight. It's great. Like everything in this universe makes great sense. Total sense. <laughs> Here we go and into the sewers. Get back on Revered's back. And over to Twilight Town. Here we go. Do, do, do. Here's your routing slip back. The mayor of Pelberg has a cold, well, tarnations and diddly dang it. Oh, but you brought this back with you. Why, thanks. You sure are a lifesaver. Oh, here, before I forget, here's your reward, Mario. Please take it. 30 coins. Let's go, let's go. We Silver Chubbers have been going strong for 20 years with our slogan, Age? What? We discuss longevity secrets and the like, you know? Maybe you'll join us in 20 years. Yeah, maybe. There we go. That's another trouble solved. Almost up to 100 coins again. Not bad, not bad. Okay, let's go see if there's any more troubles that we can do tonight. There are a few with baking that I don't want to do. Uh, we can always go talk to the mayor of Petalburg. We can head back there and do that one. Uh, but let's save that for last. Uh, I can just go this. There we go. There we go. Over to East Road Port again. Just back and forth, back and forth the whole time. I wonder if there's anything else hidden in East Roadport now that we uh, we collected the star piece and made it on the roof. The, there Actually, there shouldn't be anything left here that's hidden. We can ask uh, Ms. Mouse, though. Take a little sniff around. No, there's still something hidden here. All right. Can we upgrade anyone? Which part of what you like me to power up? Uh, let's definitely power up Vivian. Yes. 
How much is that going to take? Oh, we actually, we could probably power up both of them. Cool, cool. Alright, Vivian gets a power up. Not too shabby. Yes, if you want to power up more, let's do Ms. Mouse. Yes, power her up. There we go, we're left with one Shine Sprite. Jazubi! He's got some weird magical words. I love that the walls fall and we're just surrounded by space. There we go, that's a powered up mouse. Cool. Alright, so what in the world could still be hiding here that I don't know about? I thought we explored everything. We should go back in the house on the right once more and just check what's there. Okay, so Zesty, seeking legendary book. I want you to go find the legendary cookbook for me. It's in a pretty scary place, so there's no way an old gal like me could get it alone. Please come to my house in Roveport Square for details. Okay. We can try that. Might as well. Yeah, there's no reason not to give it a shot. Alright, what's in here again? This place. Alright, so I didn't think there was anything hidden here. Right? She's gonna say there's something hidden, but it's not in this room. It's just in this section of robe board, I guess. Alright, so... Where are we going? I don't remember where I'm meeting this person. Uh, about this trouble. We're gonna make contact in, just in Rogueport Square. Okay. Just in Rogueport Square. Let's find Zesty. Well, actually, we do know where her shop is, so I could have just gone to her shop. Alright, she is in here. Miss Zesty, there she is. Hey, you took all my trouble? Well, it's really important, so listen up, Mr. Klutz. Ages ago, there was this great legendary chef named Maitre Delicious. Rumor has it, you instantly become a better chef by reading his book. Unfortunately, it's an old book that's hard to find in store, and stores don't carry it. But I've recently heard that someone who used to live in Creepy Steeple had a copy. There are many secret rooms in Creepy Steeple, so it's moldering there somewhere. I just have to get my hands on that book and read it. Help me out, Stumblebum. So then? Want me to cook something for you? Uh, yeah, sure. Oh, no, I don't want you to cook, but I'll go find the book for you. Hello? I... No, stop cooking. I don't want you to cook. Thank you. Jesus. Thought I hit no enough times there. Alright, so we gotta go to Creepy Steeple and find hidden rooms. That's great. Uh, I guess we'll just have to use Madame Flurry, because I don't know what secret rooms there are. Wait, where am I going? This is not the right way. Gotta go to Twilight Town. This will be the last one we do tonight, folks, so uh, no matter how long it takes us to find this hidden room, we're gonna find it. I need... a beard. All right, back in Twilight Town. We are going to dash our way through these forests. And make it back to Creepy Steeple. Just ignore me, townsfolk. Running on through, no need to bother you. Oh, hello. All right. Didn't expect you there. I thought we were on a different part of the map. That's okay, we can take him down. Uh, oh, we are out of flower power. Alright, hang on. 10 FP, 50 FP. Ah, uh, we can do 10 FP. Where did that just do? Oh, that was an audience member that threw something. Okay. Take him down, Revere! Take him down! Dang, almost, almost. 
Uh-oh, one of them is invisible now. That's not good. And you're powering up. Alright, take down the second one. Got it. Crap, I can't even take down the third one. That sucks. Alright, let's do... Uh, attack all ground enemies and burn them. Yeah, let's do that. Get burned! Oh, the last one didn't get burned. That sucks. We should be able to get hurt after this turn, though, so as long as I can withstand one hit from him, I'll be fine. You're dead. Okay, seven damage, but we're fine. Now, we can power smash this dude. Nice, one more hit from Revered, and we're done. Oh no, the audience members got hit! What the heck? You dumb poor Goomba, this battle is over! I wonder what Mario's max level could be. I think we are level 12 last time I checked. But I have no idea what he could theoretically get up to. Or if there even is a max. I mean, there should be a max, but... I don't know what it is. Okay, uh, Vivian, we're gonna get out. We're gonna roll under here. Cool. And in the pipes, to the forest we go. Avoiding all these flowers that come our way. Nope, no you don't. No you do not, Flowey. Yeah, keep walking that way. There you go, there you go. Walk away. There it is, there it is. And we're in, let's go. Go, 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 go! Oh, come on. Dumb flowers. Okay, let's, uh... Let's do a hammer. You are going to burn. Hey, let's go. That's one down. One to go. Dang it. Alright, Mario didn't get put to sleep. That's good. Don't put me to sleep. Don't put me to sleep. Okay, cool. And you're dead. Goodbye, Flowey. <laughs> Alright, what kind of items do we get from that fight? Nah, nothing much. Alright, let's try and avoid the rest of the flowers. How about that? Just need you to walk past me. Good old flower buddy. Nope, that is, uh, it's not the right way. You know what? If you want to go that way, you go that way. Well, uh, we'll get around you either way. It's fine. You just, you take your time. We're good. Nope, uh, you could keep walking to the right. That would be ideal. Jeez, you're going really far left. Okay. If you're gonna go that far, I'm gonna advance a little more. Yes. Yes, we're good. Goodbye, Flowey. One more. Just gotta get past this dude and we're home free. Ah, uh, that's clo too close. I can't get past him there. Okay, but we can advance a little. Yeah, you don't got any ideas where I am. Just disappeared right in front of your eyes. Please don't stand right over top of me. Go, 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 go. Yes, we're free. Let's go. No flower fights for us. Get in that hole. Just gotta avoid this dude. Don't stop on me! You suck. Oh shoot, Mario's in danger of dying! Um, let's not do that. Actually, I probably didn't have to do that. I could have just fleed and killed myself at the uh, checkpoint. That's fine. God damn it, that's not what I was meant to do. Now my healing was for nothing. Do, 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 do. 
Ooh, just barely avoided all those rocks. Jesus. Get my coins back. Alright, I got three out of the five coins back, I think. Good enough. Here we go. We're back at the castle, and we are going to get Flurry out. And reveal as many hidden spots as we can. There's a cookbook hidden somewhere in here. Where the hell that cookbook is, I have no clue. But there's not many places to check, so... Let's use Madame Flurry anywhere we can. I have a feeling it's not going to be on a back wall, but it might be this way. Let's see if there's anything right here, huh? No? Anything with the flower? Or the star? No? Anything on this back wall? Nothing there. I wonder if there's something on the floor here. And we're going into battle. Alright, I figured we were going to end up in some battles. It's fine. We'll take them down. Actually, if anything, I name Flurry might be able to blow them away. Nope, I don't have enough flower power for that. That's not going to happen. Um, I mean, I can get full flower power back with this, but I don't know if it's worth it. <coughs> it's just some jumps. And you can do a body slam. Nice! That's one blue down. One more to go. Oh no! Nice! We dodged it. Okay, cool. I don't know what that attack was from the boo, because he didn't actually do anything, but it doesn't matter to me, because he's about to die anyway. Goodbye, flattened boo. Might as well go through the rest of these boo fights, just because then we'll have the lobby clear and we can explore. Uh, Earth Tremor's a little overkill, we don't need that. Oh, I just realized we never tattle on these guys, so let me do that. Let me switch to uh, Goombella and we'll tattle. What in the world? Why is the ceiling leaking onto my audience? Swap to Goombella. We're gonna jump on his head. That was weird, I didn't get the flip. Whatever. Hey, Goombella, you're up. Time to tattle. That's a boo! It's everyone's favorite ghost. Well, most everyone. HP 7, attack 3, defense 0. Nothing to write home about on the attack side, but it can turn invisible. Okay, cool. Let's end this battle. Here we go. Oh my god, so many coins on the ground. Amazing. Mind if I do. Alright, well, if the boo wants to stay over there, we can do a little exploring. Okay, nothing there. Anything here? No, I guess that's just the reflection. Anything on this wall? Nope. Let's go out here. Get past these... There's nothing here, right? Nope. Let's get past the swoopers. And we'll check out the wall back on this side. Not here. Anything here? Nothing on this wall? Okay. Uh, what about here? Because that just leads you back into the main room, so not that. Um. Could try moving the staircase back? I don't know. I don't know. There's a lot to try here, but I'm not sure where we're gonna go with it. Gerbil, thank you for the tier one sub for three months. Welcome on back to the Dojo Squad. Ahoy! How you doing there, friend? It's a nice green sub badge you got there. Nice green belt. Welcome in. Thank you so much for the sub. Appreciate it. Okay, should be able to get past this part. Yeah, you got that green belt, that three month sub badge. 
and see if maybe one of these walls can be taken off. Probably not. Uh, nope, that ain't gonna do it. Alright. We're trying to find a hidden room in this castle somewhere, and I have no idea where it is. And I just fell off. It's fine. Oh, actually, I should've gone the other way. Whatever, it doesn't matter. Uh, I did not try this side, though. Nope, nothing. Alright. Continue onward. Don't touch me, don't touch me, don't touch me. Thank you. Alright. Go to the other side, move the staircase over, and then we will try it again. Yeah, there's really not many other places to go. If it's not up, if the secret room is not up in the castle, we'll have to go in the basement. And that's the only other place we can check. So actually, you know what? It might be worth it to check the basement now. I, I really feel like there's not going to be anything up in the tower. So let, let, let's go down. I have a feeling we might find something if we go down. Are going to swoop? Now you gotta swoop. Get in there, Mario. Let's go down into the little hole over here. Oops. I'm trying to ground pound through the hole, but that didn't work. So what if... Ah, oh, there's Flurry. No, nothing here. Alright. I go this way? No. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Anything hidden here? I mean, my gust of wind goes through the wall, but that's about it. Uh, alright. Nothing here. Let's check out the parrot's room. Maybe there's something we missed there. Down in the dungeons. Right, we've been in this room before. Just up here we haven't been. I hope we don't have to go back around to find whatever we're looking for. That would not be fun. Uh, something hidden in the middle of the room again? No. Um, over here? Nothing. You got anything new to say? Duplis left me here and ran off. Somebody let me out of here. I mean, I can let you out of here if you come with me, but I don't think you're gonna come with me. Okay, so there's nothing in here. Uh, if the secret room is down here, I have a feeling it's up there in the windows which I have to go all the way around and through like a really hard battle room to get to. So we could try and do that, but uh, let's go back up for now. Yeah, I don't know where else this invisible, or this uh, secret room could be. Anything in here on the bottom? Oh no, this is just, this is this room. Nothing here, right? No. Nothing to be found. Now what about outside? If we go down the the well out front, we'll find anything. Or maybe if there's something hidden just literally on the outskirts. Nope. Alright, let's go in the well. I have a feeling it's something to do with this, maybe. But I have no idea how to get rid of that. This dude's dead. Okay, this room's complete. Now we can explore a little bit in here without the threat of a fight. I mean, I feel like there's definitely some way to get back this way. Can I smash it? That's a no-go. Uh, what if we go... Nah, none of these guys are gonna do anything. Do you sense any hidden treasures here? Nope. Alright, let's switch to Flurry. Or not Flurry, Vivian. Let's see if we can hide in the floor here and avoid some of this fight. Yes. Leave me alone, please. Do not rush directly at me. Okay, so maybe we can make it through this room safely without fighting a million of them. God, it's gonna be tough now that I'm in the center and they're not like conglomerated anywhere, oh boy. Uh, and there's no way for me to, like, urge them towards a specific section. Just gotta hope they're all nowhere near you. Oh god, I can't get up yet. Um, nope, now I definitely can't get up. Come on, guys, just walk away from me. There we go. No! Ah, oh, one of them got me, shit. Now we're gonna be stuck in fight after fight. 
Okay. Um, we can take him down. Actually, if I flee, won't I have inv invulnerability for a little bit? Let's do that. Because then I can just run straight through. Go, 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 go. Yes, all right, we're safe. That was right. Did you hear there was an earthquake here yesterday? I didn't, gerbil. Is everything okay there? Uh, the only news I've heard lately from Australia is that you have lost a lot of your uh, privacy rights. But I, I don't know much about that. I'm sure you would since you live there. All right, so where did this door go? Right, we had to roll under here. Is there anything we can reveal here? Nothing. Nothing. I'm also assuming that these secret rooms are only going to be revealed by Flurry. I'm not sure if there's some other ability I can use to reveal hidden stuff. Anything here? Nope. Anything on the back wall? Nope. Alright, let's drop down. You're cool. There was a 5.9 out in the countryside. A 5.9 magnitude earthquake? I think that's what they use for it. About 170 kilometers from me. Jesus. I mean, could you feel the aftershocks? Hey, good to know that this was not the right way to come for whatever secret room I'm trying to find. That's cool. That was all for nothing. Alright, let's get out of here. And I guess all that's left to do is go up the tower. I don't know where else the secret room could be. You felt the main quake, but the aftershocks didn't make it. Okay, I mean, I guess that's good. It's a good thing you were far enough away from it that it won't affect you. Let's go out this way, and up toward the tower. God knows where the hell these secret rooms are supposed to be. I'm glad you're okay, man. I hope the destruction from the earthquake wasn't too bad. There we go, stairs have moved once, and that's all we needed. Me and me. Oh, come on. Try to get in the door and avoid the fight. But okay, I guess we'll do the fight. You're dead. I was writing my paper and suddenly my monitor started swaying on the desk. The chair started rocking and there was a fair old rumble. A f yeah, fair old rumble. Jeez. That's kind of scary, you're, you know, not knowing what's going on. I've only felt one earthquake in New Jersey, uh, and I didn't even know it was an earthquake at the time. All it was was, uh, I was in my house alone, my parents were probably at work, my sister was at marching band practice, and I heard something rattling in my home, but it was just like one wall unit that was making the rattling sound. Nothing else was moving, nothing was rattling, like, I couldn't feel it, it wasn't strong enough for me personally to feel it. So I had no idea what was going on until later, uh, my mom told me there was an earthquake, and I realized, oh, that was probably the rattling I heard. I thought it was my dog making noise somewhere. I was more confused than anything. Yeah, I'm sure if you're far enough away that you, uh, not getting the damage of it, you're gonna be more confused. Okay, let's go up. Took me a second to realize it was an earthquake? That's fair. How bad was the damage out in the countryside? Ain't nothing there. Nothing there. Oh, I just realized there's a picture of Dupless in the stained glass. Boo, leave me alone. God damn it. Three boos. Alright, we can take them. We're gonna do Gale Force and see if that can work. Forgot how this attack worked. I'm supposed to hold it, not spam it. Close enough. Alright, they have two of them away. And this one's already damaged, so he's done for. Hey, Revered! Welcome on back! How was the- how was your dinner for your sister's half-birthday? Did you guys enjoy it? We are currently in Creepy Steeple trying to look for a secret room with a legendary cookbook in it. But I have no idea where this legendary room is or how to unlock it. So I've just been using Flurry absolutely everywhere to see if I can, like, reveal something. Anything over here? Nope. Alright, let's save because we're here. Why not? It was closer to Melbourne, there were a few buildings in the city that had cladding and bricks falling. Oh my god. That's terrifying if you're on the street and you just see bricks falling from a building. Good god. Anything here? Anything here? Okay, nothing. So the only other place that would have a hidden room then would have to be Duplice's top floor. I've checked everything else. 
I mean, not 100% thoroughly, but I've definitely checked everything else. It was a great... Oh, uh, dinner was great, and the secret room is the room you gotta roll into? Oh, what? I already found that room. So wait, do we have the cookbook then? I have this cookbook. A rather old cookbook. Oh my god, this is the freaking cookbook right here! I've had it in my inventory the whole time? Are you kidding me? We've been wasting so much time just searching this castle. Oh my god. I thought they wanted a legendary cookbook, and that's just called a cookbook. God damn it, I wasted so much time. It's so annoying. That's not even a secret room, it's very clearly shown. I'm pissed. I'm low-key pissed, I just wasted so much time. You have a very important badge that I need- that you need me to get? Well, I did just pick up a very important badge. Actually, uh, you missed a lot, Revered. We finished Chapter 4, and I've been doing Trouble since then. And we got a new member on our team here. We got Ms. Mouse on the team! Actually, she'll tell me if there's treasures nearby, which... There are treasures in here. What? Where are there treasures? In here? Thought I got- no, I got these That's not a treasure. I see. <laughs> yeah, we got Ms. Mouse. Uh, where is the treasure in this place? There's nowhere I can, like, slip between the blades of grass. Yeah, I can't get out of bounds. Ms. Mouse is an absolute champ. I haven't actually used her in battle yet. Haven't seen any reports of casualties or injuries. That's really good. I'm glad to hear that, Gerbil. Uh, but you also said... Luckily, Melbourne is in a COVID lockdown, so no one was on the street to get bonked by falling debris. That's lucky, although I don't know how you personally feel about the lockdown, but I've seen a lot of things online. Okay, we've been avoid avoiding these flowers all day. Hopefully we can still avoid this one. Behind the tree? Oh, there was something behind the tree. What did I miss? The block? Uh, not behind this tree. I'm jumping. There, there's nothing here. Ah, there it is. It was a little over to the right. Or to the left, I mean. Got it. So now there shouldn't be anything left there. Cool. Okay, so that's good to know if, uh... If Ms. Mouse says that there's something in the area and I really can't see what it is, it's probably just an invisible log. We also got the star piece and the uh, shrine... Yeah, the shrine piece. Shrine shard? What is it? We get this... I don't know. We got one of both of those things on the roofs in uh, East Roadport. We finally made it onto the roofs. We uh, did a little more exploring over there. She's gonna get me. Oh, she's not! Let's go! I go back into the sewers and go into the spike room. Spike room? In the rogue port sewers? Spike room. What is the spike room? I'm not sure what you're talking about, but we're heading back to rogue port now, so why don't you just show me when we get there? Leave me alone! I can't make any distance here because you're so close to me. There we go. Okay, one more to get through. This one's annoying as fuck. Uh, I assume, no, there's a badge in that room that is super important, like, jump on spikes important. Oh, you know what? I think uh, Shadow's Owl, who was here earlier, was telling us about this badge. You're gonna charge me as soon as I get out of here, aren't you? Go, 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 hide! Ah, damn it. Alright, it's just two of them. Let's take them on. And I finally learned the uh, mapping of the buttons, because I'm on PlayStation. I've got X square circle triangle, like the sign right back there. Uh, but unfortunately, I need to learn the arrangement of X, uh, what is it? X, Y, A, B. Right, you're dead. There we go. Fight over. I had one fight earlier with a gold flower, but unfortunately, it was during the time when all of my, uh, 
My party members were with the fake Mario, were with Dupless. It's a lifesaver? Yeah. We actually, we just upped our badge power and haven't put on any more badges yet, so <clears throat> if we get that one, we'll put it on. Okay, let's roll under here. And then this has been my best way, my, uh, my favorite way of traveling. Just use Revered to get everywhere. Run through all these places. Plus, it's easier to avoid fights by running. Here we go. Easy as that. And back to Rogueport. Yeah, using you to travel all the time, everywhere we go. It's just so much faster, it honestly is. Oh god dang it, I fell right freaking into him. Haha, -ha, that's what you get, sucker. Now let's do a hammer. Nice! And you can do a nice ground pound, Revered. Nice. Alright, fight's over. The lockdown in my region isn't really a... Isn't really a full lockdown. There are a few acceptable reasons to leave your house. You can go shopping or go for outdoor exercise. You can even have outdoor gatherings of up to five people, provided everyone over 16 is fully vaccinated. Jeez, alright. Go to the room inside the gate near the thousand year door. Okay. Well, uh, let me let me finish off this uh, uh, trouble first. I gotta go talk to Zesty. Also, Revere, there were a couple troubles that I either had on the list or did today that I thought I had done last time. Like I had to go back to Glitz, the Glitz Pit, and clean up all the dirty shorts again. Like I had could have sworn we had done that last time. As well as, uh, there's another one I have to do again, which is going to, uh, Pedalberg and talking to the old dude, just listening to him, which we definitely already did, so I don't know why those didn't save. Yeah, we got your cookbook. Enjoy. What's she cooking for us? What's she making? We're gonna have to drop something from our inventory. But still, some people are behaving like they're being held prisoner in their homes. Yeah, that's a lot of what I see online, gerbil. You must not have hit a save block before, but that doesn't make sense, Revered, because I, when I opened the save, I was right where we left off in Twilight Town. I was faceless, nameless Mario, and Vivian was on my team, so it doesn't make any sense. Alright, what do we get? We got a Honey Shroom, let's go! Ultra Shroom and Jam and Jelly, do it? Okay, we can do that. You solved the trouble, hell yeah. Alright, let's get you to cook with the Ultra Shroom. And the jam and jelly. Alright, cook it up. There we go, what'd she cook up? Strongest food item in the game. Sorry to keep you waiting. It is... What do we got? A Jelly Ultra! A dessert made by Zesty that replenishes 50 and 50. Wow! Alright. No, I don't want to cook anymore. Okay, I definitely want to store that in the shop so we don't either accidentally use it or have to throw it away at any point. But I'll just give us a little extra room in our inventory. Okay, I'm here to store. And take that Jelly Shroom. Or jelly Ultra. Cool. Save that for a rainy day. Okay, so you want me to go to the Thousand Year Door now. We'll get a very special badge. And then this is going to be the last thing we do today. Actually, uh, we'll do one more... One more trouble. Because there's one easy trouble I can do. Actually, I probably should have accept... Let me go back and accept the trouble before we uh, go all the way to the Thousand Year Door. I'll point out the room when I see it. Sounds good. Sounds good. Okay, let's take that last trouble. 
Mayor Kroop. Cool. So let's go back to the sewers. Way, right? Yes, this is the way. All right, cool. Go back. Oh, I'm going back. All right. Where do you want me to head? I mean, the the quick travel room is to the left. There's also this door through here that we can go in. I'll wait for your chat response, Revered. The room inside the gate. Alrighty. Oh, this room. Okay. I see. Do we need Vivian to get through here? Use Vivian and get the chest. Awesome, awesome. Oh, that was lucky. Cutting it very close every time, Jesus. Oh, Vivian got hit, but we didn't. <laughs> Let's go. We got the spike shield. Make Mario damage proof when jumping on spiky foes. Okay, this is definitely the badge that Shadow's Owl was literally talking about in the beginning of the stream today. So let's put that badge on. And how perfect. We had three open slots. Awesome. We don't need to change anything else. Right, let's get through here. Of course, she's going to get hurt again. Go, go, go. One more. And we're through. Let's go. That badge stays on at all times. Yes, I totally agree. A very helpful badge. Yeah, let's switch back to Revered so we can run. And let's get it. What? Who? Who? Ah, Mario, why did you jump off? Excuse me, sir. You're supposed to go down in the pipe? There we go. Now we can actually hurt spike enemies. Yes! Let's go! Spike enemies are defenseless! Alright, let's talk to this old bag real quick. We already talked to him before, so we're just gonna quickly skip through this and finish our trouble. Because I definitely already did, done this one before. I don't know why it didn't save. And we got a turtle leaf. Thank you. We solved the trouble. Alright, let's save... And that is going to be it for tonight, folks. So I hope you enjoyed our trouble hunting and uh, and, and uh, finishing of Chapter 4. If you want to come back next Wednesday, we will be starting Chapter 5. And always, as always on Friday, we'll be doing Fall Guys. So you can always come back for that. As a reminder, we are only $200 away from our goal of $350 for this Sunday. You have to hit that by Sunday or we can't move on to Phase 2. Phase 2 is the $500 by October 2nd. So if any of you guys feel like donating, you can use the command exclamation point and donate in chat. You can use this command even when I'm not streaming. So feel free if you need the link, there it is for you. There's also a donate tab in the about section down below. But uh, that is going to be it for me tonight, guys. So thank you so much for joining me, and I will see you on Friday. Yes, we will start Chapter 5 next week. You know it, Revered. You know it. All right. Uh, we are not going to read anyone tonight, so I, uh, I hope you guys have a great night, and thanks for sticking around. See